Thank you, Ashes. I appreciate you. All right, Ty Hitman, thank you very much for being here. Big Mike Coin Junkie, thank you very much. Ashes, I appreciate you very much for babysitting Big Flip. Appreciate that. Um, Big Mike, what's going on, bud? Thanks for coming in. Coins USA, thank you very much for coming in. Mr. Fulton, thank you very much for coming in. Appreciate you. No, it's tomorrow night. It's airing tomorrow. Huh. What am I missing there? Oh, uh, Mr. Fulton, Big Flip, the star has arrived in the big show for all America's Got Talent at 8 p.m., and I just shared you out. Thank you very much for that. I appreciate you very, very much. And then I saw something here. No, it's tomorrow night. It's airing tomorrow. Let me know what's yes. going on with that. Uh, Silver Keys, thank you very much for being here. Bryce, appreciate you. Brian, thank you very much for being here. Crafty Dragon's in the house. Are you thank muted? No, not anymore. Okay. I was. I just okay. straightened me out. <laughs> mm. Scott R., appreciate you. Must be having a night off. Thanks for being here. Appreciate you. John Francis, thank you. And Nerd, what's going on? Loud and clear. Thank you very much. All right, so we have Morgan Monday. Remember, Morgan, um, donations are $100. We already had a donation come in for Morgan Night. And um, the Morgan... Um, you, you get to keep your 40s and 90 percenters, but um, it is a $100 donation. So you can do regular silver poles or the regular um, slabs from last night. But if you want to get in on the Morgan, it is a $100 donation. Turn volume up, Big Mike. Big Mike says, can't hear you. Well, you might not have been able to hear me for a second, but you might be behind so make sure you go to the chat, you click on live chat, and then you go down to the bottom and um, click on live next to the volume button, and then uh, you'll be caught up. Appreciate you all. All right. Alexa, set timer for 10 minutes. 10 minutes, starting now. Thank you. All right. Um... Yeah, Bryce, I was muted um, for a few, but then uh, Ash has straightened me out. Hey, Big Flip, Flip Slide, hope you are both doing well tonight. We are. I got a lot done today. I did sleep in today. I needed some sleep. Flip bot. You want to play with the flip bot? Sublime, what's going on, bud? Thanks for coming in. Peter, thank you very much for coming in. Appreciate you. Bot's coming up right now. You just don't know, Ty. You just don't know why I set timers. <laughs> yeah, you Yeah, you do here. Crafty Dragon, we have six Jack Russells. Really, three Hunt Terriers and three Jacks. I just set timers for no apparent reason. I just walk around the house and had Alexa set timer for. I just want to make sure she's listening. All right. So. You don't have control issues, do you? <laughs> you stop too. You sent. You set my timer on my Alexa too. Yeah, Brent. It happens around here. Um. Alexa, turn off. Do you guys flip the little button so that the camera doesn't shine on you all the time? Because that freaks me out. Real Ruler, what's going on, bud? You must have got a notification. Thank you very much for being here. I did set the start time of this stream at 7.05. Seems like I'm always a little late, so... It's like my old boss, I told him, just don't expect me at 7, expect me at 7.05, and then there won't be a problem. Jimmy, what's going on, bud? Thanks for coming in, appreciate you. Um, I pretty much went over everything from last night, so I'm not going to go over a bunch of stuff uh, tonight, just because we've already been down that road. I don't have anything new for you guys. Blurry pick. Mm. 
Um, will you bring up your stream and let me see uh, the picture? Haven't even gotten there yet. Can you give me a thumbs up too while you're there? Mm. We'll see. Not so much. <laughs> Now I'm in the chat. All right. So who is streaming right now? There's a lot going on, I know. And I appreciate you guys being here. I do have a timer set, so be ready. Four. Don't worry about it. I'm out, Rod. Gip, gip, Pusa. Cheapskate's gone, huh? If you're getting a blurry picture, refresh. Phil, Big T, Bonnie Clyde, and Scrappin'. Hey, Ashes, I appreciate you being here. I thank you very much. Big T is doing an auction. Very neat. Seeker JW undiscovered. See, I don't have, I don't, I'm not showing any of those notifications. All right. Let me, um, I do want to see where we got this kid to last night. I'm not going to bother you guys with it all night, but I am going to hit you up one more time. For those of you that did not um, get bust up to this kid, let me go to my library. Say see all watch later. Nope, I gotta do see. Look, all. I went blurry too. Huh. Scott R says I got a notification. Very cool. Thank you for being here. Um do you guys ever check out Marling M-A-R-L-I-N-G Bates? <clears throat> that is a really cool channel. Just to let you guys know, um, that is a really, really neat channel. He makes baits and then goes out and proves he can use them. He makes crazy baits, like $900 baits. And then he makes $5 baits also. He went and carved up a lure out of, um, out of a piece of bark and then painted it up right out there and then caught the fish and cooked it up. So that is a really neat channel. So we did get this kid up there a little ways. He is at 75 subscribers. Anybody who didn't help me out last night, can you click on this link? I'm not going to bother you all night with it, but um, can you bust this kid up? I've been working on his channel for a while and he just didn't have very many subscribers, so I wanted to help him out. So there's the link. Throw it one more time, and I'll get caught up in the chat. There you go. All right. Uh, Scott R says, I got it. The notification. And then uh, Kellen L says, ready for a new job. I need a new job. <laughs> Nerd says, I was notified. I'm ready for one. Kellen L says, um, all right. I am. I think I'm caught up. So is Pammy in the house? Is that who we all roll, rolls to, Pammy? Mm -hmm. Do you have her scribbled out on the other page and written in on this one? Or? Not yet. Oh, okay. Pammy, if you are in the house, let me know. Can you send her an email real quick, hon? I know it's Morgan Monday, but what's my choices for $50? Um, you can do silver pole to grab bags, or you can do the slabs from last night if you want to get in on those. Remember the pandas and things like that? <coughs> the Morgans are the $100 donation, but I am letting you guys have the 40s and 90 percenters too. Thank you very much, Scott R., for the Diet A&W root beer. I appreciate you very much. 
Thank you very much for that donation. Hey, happy birthday, Ashes. I didn't know it was your birthday, bud. Real ruler kept us straight on that one. Hunter, what's going on, bud? Thanks for coming in. Real ruler says that's the same kid as last night. Yes, it is. You don't need to bother with it if you already got him last night. Do you have a V-hole or pontoon bolt or none of the above? Um, I have a deep V, 1968 StarCraft with dual 35s on it, dual throttle control, dual idle control, set up for downriggers and the works. It's old boat. It's my favorite boat. It's my go-to boat. It's a little finicky. And then I have a newer aluminum V. It's not a deep V. It's just a regular V, open bow. Um, move the seats around, fish on it. It's pretty nice. It comes with a 75 Evan uh, Merc. It has a 75 Merc on it. It gets us around real nice. It needs a new Bimini top, but um, that's a really nice one. And then I just destroyed a boat that I had in the backyard for a while that I wanted to... Um, I wanted to fix up, but I just didn't have the time to do it. I would much rather put the time and effort into an old 69 pickup that I have. I've had about five 69 pickups, so that is one thing that I need to work on. I have a lot of parts for it. Um, and then um, we do have two pontoons in the family. We have like a 30-footer, and then we have like a 24-footer. So when we go to the lake, we can pretty much pick and choose what we want to take down there if i go up to the mountains up to the high water lakes i mean high altitude lakes i take that deep v with me because those squalls and winds come up real quick and they i like the close bow on that one but when i go to these warm water lakes down here and i'm not so worried about freezing to death if i fall over i take the open bow um i really like my old i bought my that i bought that deep v uh back when um when Flipside was nine months old, and I've had it ever since. I did sell when it. When I was Alexa nine months old? Oh, when, when Flipside was... Oh, uh, sidekick, sorry. <laughs> Alexa, dismiss. You were only about one at that time. Um, one and a half. So, in answer to your question, uh, within the family, two pontoons, two aluminum boats, and um, we pretty much... We can get our whole family on one boat. That bi that other pontoon. Ashes said, went boat shopping today. She sh the options and selections. Well. Okay, so are you looking for a fishing boat or are you looking for a boat for the family? You're getting a 22 or 26 foot pontoon with about 115 to 150 horsepower. That'll be a beautiful boat. And um, yeah, that, that, that's um, what he's looking at, or is that the one you're buying? That's a nice one. Yeah, that will be. That's um, about Jesse's size. Yeah, well, Jesse's a little short of that one. Jesse's got a ninety on his, not a one fifty. Um, as for the motors, the new motors are just unbreakable really unless you run them dry or put some bad fuel in them or you don't add the oil when you need to but i like i like the new gen so yeah you will love that boat ashes for sure just a pleasure pleasure boat to hang out and relax and tow a tube well then you'll need that 150 because you got to remember this you might have three or four or five people on that pontoon um plus the skier or the tuber or whatever's behind you. So plus your cooler, plus your fishing gear. Yeah, you start loading plus your that thing up. Extra clothes. <laughs> so I would get the biggest motor that those things come with if you're planning on pulling stuff around. There was one down in Pueblo that had 325 horse motors on it. Now I don't know. I don't get it. Why would you want to burn three times the fuel? But it is what it is. I think it's a. I don't know. What I don't like about them, real ruler, is if the wind kicks up, it's hard to get them in because there's just so much above water. Yeah, my nephew and my uh, brother-in-law had a hard time getting their pontoons out of this little cove yesterday. Pammy Jones, there you are. What's it, going on? 
The same thing with um, happened when we were out east out of warm water. Remember, they couldn't get off the lake. Yeah. You know what? It might be this. Pammy Jones, we do have your donation here. Oh, is she here? Yeah, she just okay, stepped in. We, we're going to put her first then. So, um, you did donate like Wednesday last week or Thursday or something, so you will be first up tonight. Well, the spousal unit liked a 26-footer with a 200. She has the eye. Yeah, um, I think 200 is, well, I don't know, is what it is. Um, go big or go home, in my opinion. I just kind of like, see that dual 35 that I have is just bulletproof. If one of the motors or a magneto or something dies on one of the motors, I can still get to where I'm going. When I originally bought that boat, it had two, um, two five-gallon fuel cells in it and two 16-gallon fuel cells. And the two 16s I could take out. And uh, so it was equipped to go 350 miles on one trip. So it's really, really nice, but it's really, really small. And it's nice for, like, taking up to Canada. It's been to Mexico. It's been to Alaska. It's been to North and Saskatchewan. It's been all over the place. It's just a bulletproof boat. So um, that is a neat way to go about it. And then you might want to bring into consideration maybe when you're stepping into a 200 horse that you might need a small trolling motor to go slow and to burn less fuel than running that 200 horse. So, I don't know. I don't know what they cost for like a little teeny 25 or something, but it might save you a lot of fuel. And then it's hard to tame a 200 horse um, for uh, trolling. They do have those troll plates or whatever they are, but they don't work very good. So you might bring that into consideration, too, of having a small little motor put on there for cruising around and trolling. I'm stuck at a 14-foot Microcraft Deep V, but have a 25-horsepower Evernote on the back so I can go when I need to, giving a fish bigger water with it. That's some... Yeah, and... That's why I love my closed bow, and it's got the windshield on it. And there's not a whole lot of working room with it, but um, it is. <clears throat> I've taken some waves right up over the bow and smashed the windshield at these high mountain lakes. Um, <clears throat> figure $100 per horsepower for new boat owners. Huh. I didn't know they were that expensive, but I'm not a buy new guy. I always have to have uh, dents and dings in mind before I buy them, just because. Um, I don't know. I just I, I'm not that guy that worries about dents and dings, and I don't want though. We take care of our two trucks, but anything else, man, dents and dings. Haha. <laughs> Gotta stop meeting like this. Is that how you spell beginning? Right here. Double N? Double N. I got, st I still got a little sunburn. Alright guys, get in on that giveaway. I'm not a I'm buy also new throwing guy up the chat uh, the end of stream link. <laughs> That's me too, real ruler. And and then again, you know, I did went down that road on a truck one time and I just decided it wasn't worth it. So I that's why all the other ones I've bought um every since um have had like twenty or thirty thousand miles on them. I just, I don't know, I just couldn't handle the, all the money that fell off of that thing when I drove it off the lot. 12 foot aluminum with a 9.9 .9 Johnson and I pull it with a Honda. I huh. think you can call it a boat. <laughs> Going junky. <laughs> Looking at Bass Pro today, motors were on sale for 80 to 95 per horsepower. Well, what kind of motors were those? Don't get any ideas. Oh, I don't need any <laughs> motors. Just well, you know, the DV might 
could do with a couple, but that's like a five thousand dollar setup. I made it in for a few minutes. Mischief, what's going on? Thanks for coming in. Appreciate you. Uh, Pammy, so you will be up first. Do you want a regular box or a holy box? Let me know. I'm getting the backyard ready for bringing in some gravel and a little bit of sod. We've, uh, we've decided that we're going to bring in some pea gravel for the dogs and some sod for the dogs. And then one area over there on the side is going to be bigger gravel for parking the boats in the um, old truck back there. Holy. Hmm. I was thinking maybe some some of that shredded asphalt for that area that's for parking. Yeah, we'll have to do something. Might be a better option. All right, so we have 29 oh, watching. Box. All right, you got it. Uh, 28 in here and 27 watching. We'll get down to uh, the nitty gritty on hunting this box here in one second. Let's do this giveaway and then I'll run upstairs. I told the spousal unit the number one son, no boat until March. So next season, waiting on the first retirement to come in. Mm. Lucky, lucky. Well, look for, hey, Ashes, so here's what you need to do. You need to look for a boat like that in a state that's like within 12 hours away and get snow and ice. And then you'll get a good deal on a boat that, that comes out of a state with snow and ice because they're sick and tired of making the payments on them for the six months they can't use them. And uh, you can pick up a pretty, pretty good deal on a boat, especially if you're waiting six months or so. Um, Sounds yeah. like he's looking at new, though. Well, even that. So you might look into that. Um, as long as they've taken care of it over the winter. They've winterized it and stuff like that. That's how I do stuff. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's what I would do myself. I um, Like that truck I just bought, I went to Missouri for that thing because I got 5000 off this what it was going for here. What do you need? Um Coin Junkie AG, congratulations, my bud. Give me a number between 1 and 10. Hey, you a silver stacker, what's going on? Oh, that's great, Pammy. Yeah, it's been a while for a lot of people. We finally got ours. Hey. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Oh, wait, you guys can't see. What is up with that camera? What? It's killing me. All right, let me change the view. Maybe it's time to upgrade One, it or two, something. three, four, five, six, seven. We did upgrade it. Those are brand new cameras. Then I would have to say it's the operator. Ten cents out of Canada, right up your alley, 1928. Not killing you, just fuzzing you. Yeah. Uh -huh, uh -huh. <laughs> oh, and this is a neat one. Don't get him started. He'll start with the blonde jokes again. Oh, well, I think they're coming anyway. 1952 out of Honduras. That is neat. I'm going to uh, see if I can't find another piece of porn instead of sending you that Canadian dime. Because I know you have plenty of those. Oh, here's one. I'll mix and match for you. Let's do this one. Unless you want that Canadian dime, but let's do this one. 1955. Out of El Salvador. So you got one out of Honduras and one of, out of El Salvador. Man, that's pretty crazy. Um, I went to uh, private school when I was in junior high, and three of the students that were um, in the private school, one of the girls was from El Salvador, and two of them were twins from Honduras. Pretty crazy. All right. Um, and that was a holy box, right? I'll be back. I'm going to go get the holy box. Uh...
Wow, that coffee's hot. <laughs> Poor. I just put the end of stream link up for anybody who has not made a comment on that. Oh yeah, he was a heartbreaker. I suppose was is the key word there. Is anybody watching NASCAR in the background? One of the makeup races is on right now. That's why I'm wearing my Dale shirt. <laughs> Look, the word is reprimand. Really? Mm-hmm. Will you mark that down for Coin Junkie, please? One of the video game races. No, they're no. they're racing with empty stands. Ashes. <laughs> yes, John me. John Francis is watching. Yeah, I, I'm recording it right now. I was working outside all day. Well, not all day. I slept oh. in pretty good. Coin junkies on a lucky streak. Yeah, he won last night too. Mm-hmm. Oh, he won from Cajun. He won those two pennies from Cajun. Mm -hmm. and give me a number between 1 and 50. My knife is pointing at number 1. Fleabag, what's going on, bud? Thanks for coming in. Appreciate you. 11, 10, 11, right there. Thanks for keeping it plain and simple. 
Pam, you did have 10 rolls, correct? Yep. All right. Pammy, you want 40 percenters or 90 percenters? Let me know. Um. You know, it might have been a nice day and Silver Keys might have went fishing because she was supposed to do that a couple days ago. Maybe. She's still going to get written up. <laughs> Did she send you an email? No, I don't know. I didn't check. It's all right. No. A friend of mine... Pennies to Benji's, thanks for being here. I appreciate you. I'm sorry about your friend. I'm sorry about that, my friend. You should have. <laughs> Knock it off, real ruler. And then Pammy said 90. Got it. Um, I happen to have Kennedy's or Benji's. Let me know which one you want. Benji. How about this one? 1952. Look at brand new glove already tore up. Oh no. Good luck. We did find a couple silvers last night. Better than a sharp stick. You know the dealio. And I'm sorry, Pammy, we weren't oh, okay. here on Friday. Ash, it says, so please will be here in an hour late. She popped in earlier. Oh, okay. it's not a problem. She's always here for us, so. Yeah, she is. We just get worried when we don't see her. <laughs> And I didn't get an, an email from Silver Wishes, unless you got it. No? I did not check emails today. I was working. And I have... Penny says, I have two adopted sisters from Iran. Very neat. Hey, there's silver wishes right there. How are you doing today? Mer uh, silver wishes, thank you very much for being here. I appreciate you. I hope all is well. We did not catch um, an email from you in reference to how you were doing. Twenty-eight and thirty-three up. I'll tell you what, you guys killed it last night in here. There was a lot of thumbs up in here last oh, night. Oh, Ashes, I see you said that earlier. I'm going back and uh, seeing what I missed. <laughs> Real ruler. A few minutes ago said. You should have made him work for it a bit, Pammy. Tell him the square root of 121 or something. <laughs> yeah, no. I can't square root anything. Breeze for me. Thank you very much for being here. I appreciate you. Cubed root. Yeah, no, that's... Even if I had like an hour to figure out the cubed root of 1331, um, 
no. I'm pretty sure that's a trick. Yeah, I don't well. think there is a cubed root of that. If number. there is a cubed root, I still couldn't do it. So. Oh, eleven. <laughs> Mm. Mm -hmm. Yo, good luck I with your. I used to be super good in all those equations. Good luck with your boat hunting ashes. I hope you get what you like. And ashes, another thing is pontoon boats. You have to have a cover for them. Um, you might even think of going to a canvas shop and having them put it, build you a a um, really nice cover for them to guard your seats because those seats can get real expensive once they get beat up by the sun. And there's a lot of seats. And, you know, just an FYI, and spend the $200 on a cover for it. Did anybody barbecue today? If you did, what did you have? We did some ribs. I had one rib before we started. Pammy Jones, I'm very sorry. There was only one NIFC there. Watch your ears. All right, Pammy, are we doing grab bags? Are we doing silver pull for you? Hamburgers and hot dogs, that's the stuff. My boat needs a new seat in the back, but new ones are only about 40 bucks. What kind of boat do you have, real, really? I may have missed it. Bree says air fried steaks, simple hamburger air and corn fried. on the cob, grab bags. I've never air tried air frying a steak before. We so surveyed Smoked ribs. The blonde jumps in there with smoked ribs. I'll get that for you. Let me refresh to make sure I'm. Two, four, six, eight, I'm ten, up to twelve. Date, CM, and I'll get you a lineup. Six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen. There's eighteen bags here. We had pizza, not on the grill. One and fourteen. Give me two numbers. Nerd says it rained all day. Four and seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. I like it when the chat goes slow. I had leftover pizza today. I made it on Friday. Nice and tender, huh? Hmm. All right, let's see what you got. We'll save the slab for last. We did get a Lewis and Clark, um, Philadelphia and Denver, um, Westward Journey Nickel Series set. That will be coming to you. And we'll save this slab. Ooh, you did Brian get says, a barbecue almost every day. Today we glazed ham steak on the grill. Ooh. Ooh, did you put pineapple too? Barbecue a little pineapple. 1942 Mark Dime. A 19... 14 foot Miro Craft. That's nice. 1908 Barber. That's quarter. Ooh, that's a nice quarter. Silver Wishes says, check out the photo. It just came in an email. Okay, I will do that. Sublime had smoked ribs. Ben, Penny's to Benji's has not eaten yet. Real Ruler grilled steak and hot dogs yesterday. Grant's simple hamburger and corn on the cob. Oh, I love corn on the cob. I wish I would have got some of that. Fix an AC unit and mowed the lawn at my friend's house. And now listening to you and fixing the dishwasher. Nineteen sixty-three in a mint wrapper. Penny. You got a nineteen forty-five out of Philadelphia wheat scent. A nineteen forty-six out of San Francisco. 
1956 out of Denver, and then two steel cents. Ouch. This one is out of Denver, and that one is out of Philadelphia. Oh, they're both out of Denver. Then you ended up with this quarter uncirculated. Perry's Victory out of Ohio. Uncirculated quarter. I'm going to stick your two pieces of silver in there in the flip with a quarter. And then you got two slabs. The first slab, 2004 SPCG SPR 69 DCAM. The keel boat, very neat. It is a nickel. And it is definitely a DCAM. And I will scan that in one second. And then a 2001 S Vermont clad 25 cent PF69 with ultra cameo. Last three digits, 017. Really neat coin there. I'll see if I can't get that in there for ashes and I'll scan the other one. Do you have my phone by chance? Or, oh, here it is. Leaning up against the microphone. Asha says NGC 14. So that that uh, Vermont clad is 14. And let's go PCGS and let's scan it. Raptors threw some 13s in there. Says hello. Hey, what's going on, Raptor? Got Thanks. some Raptor gas going on there. He's always got Raptor gas. The keel boat is $12 on PCGS, so congratulations to you on those. Thank you very much, Pammy, for your donation. Uh, thank you for being here for us. I appreciate you. Stop. So thank you. I'm happy, happy, happiest. Thank you very much. I just kept oh my goodness yeah that happens to me they when they try to do anything on my arm what happened with the email can I see it or no um it's a um I don't know if you can see it yeah you can see it um holy moly yeah it's from them trying to do an IV and she says that's only five out of um twenty you know how I get like that too with my arms when they miss. Yeah. I get so mad at them too. I make. You know, I tell them they get one. Now I tell them they get one shot. If they don't get it, they'll have to bring somebody else in. Uh, a um. Um. What, what are they called? Sticker. And I have C. Yes. One. Okay. Let me Do you ever get the five dollar silver cert last night? Did you ever give away? Yes, I did. As a matter of fact, I did. All right, and I know Pammy has. Um, we NISC got there in the bank, so let me check and see. Bank to a ninety. Yeah. Yeah, we I got you on that. Some. And you definitely want the barber, and you definitely. Hey, Scott R, what's going on, bud? Thanks for being Pammy, here. Pammy, you have four in there right now, so this will make five. I have to go grab some bubble wraps. I'll be right back. Kristen Cuervo, how are you? Welcome. Scott is back. PayPal and I'll update the list.
<laughs> Jimmy says ankle biter. Yes, I had to let the smoky up stairs because everybody ran outside and he wanted to go. Mr. Fulton Rats, I have a timer on my phone to remind me tomorrow when that comes on. Plus, ours is recording. So I'm looking forward to seeing that for sure. So what's up, Big Flip, tonight? Les, what's going on, bud? Thanks for coming in. Appreciate you. We are doing a small coin roll hunt tonight, I think. Um, but you know what usually happens around here. We end up running late. So we're never in a rush here for sure, Us. I'll be in and out tonight. My mom fell today and split her shin and got a knot in the head which is a black eye. Now, Pammy Jones, I'm very, very sorry about that. I hope all goes well with that. Thank you very much for your donation, Pammy. I appreciate you. Who did I miss? Yeah, sorry about that, Pammy. Um, um, we're just doing our thing here, Les. I appreciate you coming in. Thank you very much. If I missed anybody in the chat, put 13s in the chat, and I will say hello to you. Mischief says, I may not be here for my polls. I would like 40s, bank to 90. And if I get any and a fat, slabby grab bag, please. <laughs> okay. You got it, Miss Jeff. I appreciate you. All right, here's a link. If anybody, hey Les, can you grab this link up? Thirteens in there for you to say uh, hello. Head over there and see if you can help this kid out. He runs an outdoor channel. He's a local kid. And uh, anybody else who didn't grab this kid last night, can we do that, please? I want to get him to a hundred, and then I'm going to quit. We got him from thirty-nine, I think, to seventy-five. We had him at eighty, but then of course YouTube purged, so he lost some. All right, who's up next? Two rolls? No, we're going to wait on that one because um, Silver Keys is not here. So we're going to go over to Gordon. Uh huh. Gabois. Ten rolls. And I don't know if Gordon is here. Let me see if he left messages. Uh, little Penny threw 13s in there to say hello to you. Hey, Little Penny, what's going on? Thank you very much for being here. I appreciate you. Thank you, my friend. You should always say um, hi in the chat so you get the accumulated hours in my room. I know you know that, but Ow. thank you very much, Les. I appreciate that. Big Mike, he's at 48 hours in my room. Thank oh, you very much. Oh, Ow, that looks painful. That is a, definitely looks like it needs stitches. Oh, that's going to okay? leave a mark. <laughs> I should have warned you. <laughs> you guys want to see mine? Oh, yeah. He, he fell a couple times. Uh, 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 see it? Uh, All his scratches. Uh, war it was a war zone out there. Yep, and he's got a, he's got a scrape going from his But knee, nothing like that thing. Holy his moly. His knee to his upper, outer... Uh area yeah no nothing like that I've been here over 300 hours and I didn't know that until just now well I'm pretty sure real ruler you've been here a lot longer than that you just haven't been chatting you just have to rub some dirt on it <laughs> he actually rubbed dirt and shale yeah slipped on some shale I rubbed dirt on it trust me Look at those gams. Woo woo. That's just it. Knock it off. <laughs> oh, got him got 
some boo-boos. You know? Nothing like that, though. <laughs> Pammy, you got to get that taken care of. You can't leave that alone. Yeah, that's her mom. Yeah, you got to... Yeah, that one definitely needs some stitches. And if you wait too long, they can't stitch it up. That looks pretty fresh. Did you get that thing stitched up or what? How many hours do you need to hit silver? I don't silver know, Raptor. Brushes. I have almost caught up to you. I'm at 724. She's at 739. That's the closest we've been in a long time. Oh, um, you know what, Raptor? I am sorry. I need to check that out. I am not sure. But I need to... Um, I'll look at that this week. I'm going to actually put that on my notes. We don't know. Sidekick set it up. Right, but I don't know that we actually set that up. Tammy it. says she has 72 hours. That's a long time, man. Pammy, they really do keep everybody separate. Um, I would not risk getting an infection. Um, they, I, I know because I, when I fell, I, that's why I didn't go right away when I fell down the stairs that time. These are um, double G's rolls. And maybe butterfly. Can you see the book? Back, but, uh. What are you looking for? Oh, yeah, these are Gordon Gabois rolls. He did get a marked ender. He'll have a 90%. Probably Ben Franklin coming to him. Uh, I'm at 104 now. Still copper. <laughs> Oh. You know, if she heals well, you probably if you are really good with those butterfly things, that might work. Gordon, are you in the house? Let me know. If she's anything like his parents, they just don't heal on the skin like they used to. Pammy says, I followed all the nursing steps that my memory would allow. Ah. Good. Please do not put off going to the doctor ER worrying about the C-19. Yeah, absolutely correct. Hey, Taylor. Just stopped in to say hi. Last night was fun. It was, and I was pretty tired. I was out like a light after that. Taylor Sizer, thanks for being here. I appreciate you. And thank you for the giveaways last night. That was awesome. And thank you for the round table pizza, my friend. That was awesome. Thank you very much for that. Okay, Gordon. Um, I do not see Gordon in here. We will do a card thing for him. I'm not afraid. Well, yeah, he's the one who had said something about a Morgan, but he didn't donate for a Morgan. Penny's uh, De Benji says, uh, "Come on over there, and she'll stitch you up." <laughs> Real ruler. I use super glue for all my cuts. Yeah, pennies to Benji's. My sister does too. I've never used super glue on my cuts. And I've had a lot. You know what I would do? I would either pull them a silver pull or a slab and then I'd send him an email and give him an opportunity to mm -hmm. add to it, put that back and get that Morgan when he comes in. All right, so that's what we're gonna do. Um, he did say that he wanted a Morgan, but he didn't understand that there was a $100 donation. So the fifth cut or no cut in the chat between 1 and 40 is the one that we're going to pull for him and set aside. And then if he comes in and he wants to upgrade, we can do that too. The fifth one in the chat. Cut or no cut, the number between 1 and 40. You have an updated invoice. I didn't even see you on the computer today. What did you buy? That was yesterday. 
click on it. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was going to say, that's pretty tricky because you were working in the backyard the whole time. Hmm. Can you uh, send it? Okay. One, two, three, four. It's a cut 13 by Ashes. I think you timed that, Ashes. Cut. Hold on a minute. Can you check PayPal and make sure that I didn't pay that already? I thought I paid that that night. Well, it says amount due zero. It's just the invoice. Oh, okay. Yeah, I thought I paid it. All right. This is for Double G. It's the two of clubs. Double G. I love it. <laughs> oh, he's still got a nice slab. Holy moly. So, it's an 88S Olympics $1 PF69 Ultra Cameo. Number 013 for a cut 13. There's the scan. We'll see what Ashes comes up with on that. But that will be for Gordon, and he'll get a 90 percenter. And it'll be this Benji right here. 1954. You, you found some Benjis? Uh, I stole some from Noah and gave him a couple barbers. Uh, NGC30 on that coin right there. Thank you very much, Gordon. I appreciate your donation. And uh, you can send us an email if you want to roll that up to a Morgan. Sorry, got a dog that won't come out of the from under the bed. Oh, yeah. that's mine. Smokey does that all the time. Does your dog like balls? Because that's how I get him out. I think I was French in a previous life, because I can spell French names like it's going out of style, but I can't spell. Let me see. Gabois. B o i s e. Nui. Gabois. Gordon, thank you very much. I appreciate you. Uh, nerd says PayPal sent. Okay. Do you? S <laughs> <laughs> Um, real ruler? I don't know what you mean. I surrendered hourly around here. Do you hear Smokey knocking on the gate? Oh, he can push it open. Scott R for 10 rolls right now. Two. Four, six, eight, and ten. Okay, that's sunburn. Scott, Scott is up right now, right? Yes, he's up now. And that sunburn on my back is itching now. Nerd, I got yours. Thank you. I will add you to the list. Thank you very much for all the donations tonight. I appreciate you guys. Coin Junkie says, come on, goodies. It's like having a hole in your sock. It was irritating me. I ordered some gloves from Amazon, but they're just not working out. I got to go back to my old standbys. Did you order the? Did you do the refund? Um, no, I have not yet. Big flip surrender. He's married. <laughs> Boy, that glove feels good. Where'd you find that one? Was hiding? Out of my bag stash. Mm. Pre-COVID gloves. I hate to hear that. Keep it clean and change the bandage. I've already <laughs> been there and I got a little resistance in that waiting till AM will be acceptable because of our anxiety. 
and blood pressure. Well, yeah, just address it for sure. New Familia, what's going on, bud? Hey, New Familia, let me, um, I want to chat with you for a second. Let me do this. Scott R., I'm sorry. Let me grab this real quick. Um, yes, Scott, do you have a bag of treats that you can shake and get him out of there? Or the other one would be, you know, a tennis ball. Fishing pole with a hook? <laughs> no, don't listen to this one. On the other, you know, you can always get the soft end of the broom and just kind of, you know, not hard, but just kind of gently put it under there. I mean, from the other side, you being on the other side of the bed away from the door, and that'll give him a clean shot out the door. Whoa, what's going on? It's not showing me familia. <laughs> or Ash just said... Hold on, new familia. Girl. Hold on, my brother. It's not showing what? I can't... Look, there's new familia right there. Right. But I can't get him to show in the room. See? Crazy, huh? Well, then there's something wrong. Might be on restriction. Might have a restricted channel. I don't know. What did you... Thank you very much, Scott. I appreciate you. I wrote a note right there, if you want to know. New Familia, thank you very much for coming in. Um, it's not showing you right now, my friend. I don't know why. Can anybody else in here tag New Familia? Real ruler. <laughs> Ashes says, yell, squirrel. I'm not going to repeat what real ruler said. That's check on... Check Click on the live chat again <coughs> to <coughs> refresh. Yep, there it is. <coughs> Thank you very much for that, Raptor. You're a smart guy. Ashes, apparently you got to refresh. Hey, pizza guy, what's going on, bud? Thanks for coming in. Appreciate you. Scott R says, going to try a broom in a minute. Oh, yeah. Um, so I have a nightmare of a story. We were watching the neighbor's cats, and I had some real heavy leaders hanging up in my closet for for ocean fishing and the cat was playing with one and took one to the roof of the mouth. Ooh, at your mom's? Yeah. I didn't and, know you then. And the cat was spinning around off the 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 clothes post in the closet and then I cut the line to get the cat off of the line. Cat ran under the bed dragging the leader and snagged up the leader underneath the bed. Oh, it was terrible. We had to roll the bed over and dig the cat out of there, and we were all walked away, bloody mess, and had to take the cat to the vet and get the hook removed, and holy moly. Uh, so here's, wow. the, here's the short end of the story. Do not hang leaders in the closet when you're watching the neighbor's cat. They didn't like me much after that. Mischief had a good idea. She says, ring the doorbell 
or knock on the door to get the dog out from under the bed. But yeah, my dogs don't react to squirrels. Loki is scared of them because they are bigger than him. <laughs> well, my dog took one out yesterday. One squirrel light in this neighborhood. On my floor. But he didn't take it out on the floor. He brought it in. Tastes just like chicken, Penny says. <laughs> That's so wrong. Got one. Oh, wait. What's the pizza guy doing? Pizza guy's mixing it up. Les says, I have no privileges any longer. Les, back in January, we started all over with mods. Yeah, Les was one of our first mods, I think. Yeah. And it's nothing personal. We just had too many. And well, no, that wasn't the, um, what was happening is a lot of people were blocked from my channel that I didn't know about, and I wasn't doing my due diligence, so, and then there was a lot of drama stuff going on in here, and I had a powwow with a couple other channels on how I should fix the problem, and we came to a census that I should just pull everybody back and give out three wrenches and that's what I did. Um, it's nothing personal. But it's worked out really, really well. And as a matter of fact, we haven't had one of those big T words in a very long time. So it worked out really, really well for us. I bought a BU55D quarter at the coin store for $3. And it looks like a D over D. Mikey, you come up with this stuff. Uh, you're just awesome. That's why you're accepted into this community, and I appreciate you for being here. Scott has two NIFCs now, so that will make three. Yeah, nothing personal less, for sure. Scott, are you banking to 90s now? Watch your ears. Hey, Siren, what's going on? Thanks for coming in. My back hurts. My back. My oh, back. is it busy, Siren? She's at work and it's really crazy busy. There's been another wrench or two handed out, but only when merited. Yeah, budget. Um, you caught a wrench because you do so much work around here. There are two other wrenches that are going to disappear. Um, they were just temporary because they had stuff to do. I think Cajun was one of them and another one, but those. Um, those wrenches are going to disappear. I have I have the perfect amount of wrenches. I can't there on my side. <laughs> yes, banking to the night for nineties. All right, Scott, go oh, ahead and give me Ashley's a number. Finished the garden today. That's awesome. I still have. Um, I like to put when I do the green beans. I like to plant them a couple weeks apart, so I need to put uh, more seeds in, just so I don't get them all at one time. Andrew, what's going on, my bud? Thanks for coming in. Appreciate you. Scott R, go ahead and give me a number and cut or no cut. Uh, I think there's 40 here. Hello, we'll be John, safe with 40. John, are you new in here? John, thank you very much for coming in. I appreciate you. Welcome, if you are. Make sure you comment on, will you throw that link up there for me? Um, well, a $25 donation gets you a grab bag that's built by my coin store. A $50 donation gets you a silver pole, which is kind of like all the other channels have. Um, and then a $100 donation will get you um, a Morgan slab tonight, or you can go with a one gram gold maple. Or And then um, each $25 donation gets you a 40 percenter. You can upgrade to a 90 percenter with three 40s. And then it just kind of goes from there. So uh, $25, $50, $100 full box donation of $250, however you want to do it. You can even do $75 bucks and get a silver pole and a, a grab bag. My grab bags, I don't, I never know what's in them. 
We've had, uh, for a $25 donation, we've had an $80 slab come out of grab bags. I don't build them. My coin store builds them. People like to start there, and so that's something to think about if you're into, um, you know, lots of, uh, like, wheat scents and steel scents and barber quarters and barber halves and slabs, you know, like a Westward Series slabs, things like that. Um, grab bags are the way to go on that. So I hope that helps you out. What do you need for a slab box? Um, okay, big flip. What do you need for a slab box? Um, oh, are you asking me for one of my slab boxes? Um, because they're cheaper to order off of Amazon than they would be for me to even give you one of my boxes and then ship it. My neighbor gave me a 2004 proof West Point Mint American Silver Eagle one ounce. Well, you gotta love that. You got a nice neighbor. One of the slabs from the box. Oh, um, that's a $50 donation, but if you want to go with the Morgan slabs, it's a $100 donation, and you get to keep your 40s and 90s. This is Morgan Monday, or you can do a peace dollar too. I have a box full of peace dollars over there. It's not a complete box, but it is a, um, a box with, I don't know, 15 of the um, peace dollars in it, and then we have a full box of Morgans tonight. All right, I'm going to, you guys are going to pay attention. Wow. <laughs> Cut 36. Cut. Mm. I wanted him to read the whole comment. Let me go back and see. Siren says I'm locking the doors and drinking Gatorade. There's number 36, Scott Arth. Hey, I appreciate I you very, very much, Scott. Thank you very much. Good luck with the... What's it, a dog or a cat? A dog under the bed? Dog, yeah. Are you a going... A little tiny dog. So did you read the one that says, I'm so glad I don't have a wrench... Big flip, love you, brother. Just want to enjoy streams. Cut in 41 LL. I mean 36. Oh, is that Scott? Mm hmm. Yeah. Okay, Th he did read that. <laughs> um, yeah, you know, I go into rooms and it's like, I don't know, wrenches? Uh, I don't know. Used to be my thing. I, I would look forward to getting a wrench, but then. I don't know. It comes with being on YouTube a long time. The novelty goes away for sure. Well, it's a that. lot of work. It. My moderators work their butts off in here. I mean, literally, it's a lot of work. Ashes does a double dip on Sunday with Shibby and me, and I, I don't know where else he goes. But it's crazy. They all do. Yeah, Siren, Silver Keys, yes. I farm them and out. I, I bring in an income on those three. <laughs> you do not. Oh, yeah, I do. I get, yeah, you can rent a moderator. Hey, Scott. <laughs> Just not. It's called the RAM session. It's rent a moderator. And uh, you can you can pick them up for two, three hours at a stretch. Hey, Scott, congratulations. 1988. Sick for over a month and zero YouTube. I am so sorry. Glad you are feeling better though. The only mod two places. Well, thank you very much, Ashes. 88s Olympics one dollar PF69 Ultra Cameo. This is the first one ever graded. 001. Crazy, Scott. Congratulations. Is my only mod two places. That's the problem with stickers. Oh, that one will come off. Rub some dirt on that one. No, don't rub any dirt on it, but it will come off. <laughs> gotcha. Because Big Flip is always right about how many cards are in the deck. Not always. Uh, but I do know how thick 
uh, the deck usually is. So that's coming to you, Scott, along with the 90% Benji. Siren says, silver and gold is my cost, and I mod at about eight. I don't know how you do that and work. You need I have a hard enough time modding on this one and getting my stuff done. <laughs> Jason, what's going on, bud? Thanks for coming in. Appreciate you. Yeah, I put my mm -hmm. mods to the test. They, I'm sometimes forget my brains. Where's a purple zoot suit when it comes to us mods? <laughs> I'm a mod on a few channels. It's a lot of work. Most of the channels are ghost hunting and a couple of coin related. Oh. <laughs> Real realist. I'm going to spread it around the big flip is renting out siren by the hour. <laughs> I can't go there. I can't. I got nothing. <laughs> Scott R., thank you very much, my bud. I appreciate you. That's heading to you. I hope you like that slab. Let me know. I can't get anyone to mod for me. Why? It makes it a little harder since YouTube changed the format. Yeah, for sure. And I, I think that it really... It, yeah. I hope they change it back at some point. I hope they get enough complaints. Indiana Tones, how are you? Hey, what's going on, bud? Sam's Thanks for being here. Pursuit of Happiness, how are you? It says, good morning, everybody. Mm -hmm. Where are you at? That it is morning. Sam's, what's going on, bud? Thanks for coming in. Appreciate you, Stack Deck. Thank you very much for coming in. Appreciate you. Are you in Europe somewhere? <laughs> Welcome to tonight's episode of Rent a Mod by the Hour, brought to you by Kennedy Half Dollars and Two Dollar Bills. <laughs> Yeah, I, LOL, it's not morning. I just got to, mm -hmm. I just got to work. Nice 12 hour shift. Ah, my son is doing 11 hours. Well, yeah, he's at, I guess he's doing 10 hour shifts. Let's see if, if he's paying attention. This guy says, okay, I got to go work on a tiny dog. I'll be back. Maybe. <laughs> Bring treats. Yeah, and that's why I have a handle on my mods for sure, Archaeology Mikey. We'll see how long it takes. <laughs> you got it. All right, give me a number between 1 and 10. Thank you for being here, Archaeology. I appreciate you. Mr. Mikey. Mischief is back. Yeah, oh, we can get going again now that Mischief's back. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Right there, my bud. Let's see what you got. That one's going to be an old one. Oh, it's sixpence. <laughs> Mischief says, I didn't expect you to stop for little old me. Oh, yeah, we came to a screeching halt when you left. <laughs> Thanks for coming back, so now we can get going again. And then this thing. Scott says, how's your root beer holding up? Don't worry, I'm not buying anymore for a while. Um, my root beer is good. I'm good. Matter of fact, um, I bought some cans the other day. The bottles are hit and miss for sure, but... Thank you very much for that. I appreciate you. Well, archaeology, these are well circulated, but they are still nice pieces of silver. That is out of Canada, and I don't think we can catch a date on this. But maybe you can catch a date on it when you get it home. Those two pieces of silver are coming to you. Thank but you very says, much. Let me see the other one. 1895 six pence. 
Oh, he's got something down on there. Yes. 18.95. Sixpence. Ashley says, ever tried Bark's Diet Root Beer? Bark, Bark's? Bark's? I think it tastes like pepper. I think Bark's tastes like black pepper. That's not the one in the bottle. The one in the bottle that you're thinking of? is a natural root beer. Oh. I don't know that we've tried that one. Oh, well, thanks for that, Mikey. Says I have much younger eyes. I can do it. <laughs> that one is really nice. At 1895. It's got a little ring hit, but that's heading to you, my bud. Will you write Mikey on there for me? Mm-hmm. All right, who's up next? Sorry. That would be Ashes C4, Ken Rolf. Hey, Ashes, thank you very much for your donation. I appreciate you. Oh. I'm going to give you... A barber half. 1900. That will be heading to you, mm -hmm. Ashes. Thank mm -hmm. you for being a mod in my channel. I appreciate you. Let's crack the top on these. My grandfather gave me a dateless buffalo, and when I put it under the scope, it turned out to be a 1913. Wow. I have a lot of dateless buffaloes. Um, I just don't want to nicodate them. I think they're better without Nicodate. So, hey, Far North Coins, what's going on, bud? Thanks for being here. I appreciate you very much. Oh, 2003, right off the bat. Right there. Sam's Pursuit of Happiness wants to know how you can tell if it's been nicodated. Uh, it'll have a it'll have a burn mark in it that you can't get out. It falls down into those cracks, and uh, you just can't get them out. You can't get that nicodate off of there. It'll be discolored down by the date. Far North Coin says milky spot. Yeah, like a toner color change. Cleaning coins and nicodating coins should you should never do it. Real ruler says nicodate is an acid. Sam, thank you very much for being here. I appreciate you. Said NASCAR race over, let me know. It's a commercial up there, so I can't tell. Princess Silver says, so hello everybody. Hope everybody is well. <clears throat> hey Prince, what's going on? Thanks for coming in. Appreciate you very much. We are well. Hope you are well.
Hey, Ashes, you got a box of pennies or nickels around? You want to do a box battle with me this week? I'll let you pick the time and date. NASCAR said. <laughs> Far north points. Yes. They're out there racing. We are definite NASCAR fans. I bought 64 quarter in average condition for a buck. Okay, first of all, you're already ahead. And it might be a DDO in the junk silver bag. Well, you cease to amaze me. Wait, did I say that right? You amaze me. Mike, you, what you pull off. Broom worked. <laughs> yeah, they don't like those things. Um, I never even touched them with it, but if, but I will. If, if you won't come out and I'm getting going to be late for work, I will definitely grab a broom. Thank you for waiting. Yeah, sure. Anything for you, dear. Oh. Oh, mm -hmm. Gotta get back on keto. Yeah. I have two boxes of pennies. You want to hunt Ooh. pennies? We can do that. We'll do that again. You pick the date and time. If you want to pick it right now in here, let me know. I'll set my timer. And if you want to send me an email, we can do that also. Uh, any ASCs left in the box with the panda? Um, I don't know. Let me see. Oh, yeah. Um, and they are all the same, so I'm just going to grab you one out of here. All right, well, here, pick. Pick a number. Matter of fact, let me move them down. Are you moving them the right direction? <laughs> move them down. <laughs> I, said, I have no patience with them. I've never had a dog mouth listen to me. My Brant, Brant says my daughter's working on a penny box and has 32 Canadians and 32 Wheaties. 36 Canadians and 32 Wheaties. That is awesome. Um. This. Yeah, but it is not an eagle. Yeah, you got one. You write two NIFCs down for ashes. It's 2016. Yeah, let me look it up. Was he looking for an eagle or a panda? Oh, no, he was looking for an eagle with the pandas. PCGS MS69 Silver Eagle 30th Anniversary First Strike. 352 is the last three digits. That will be heading to you. Okay, ashes, that gives you two in the bank. Looks like... You are paid out. Ashley's got a barber out of that deal and a MS69. You know what? That barber looks dented, bent. bent. You grab you a different barber. I think that barber's dented. Let me grab you the oldest barber in here. Don't you know three Doc says, I'm not mean to him. I'm just used to my pets listening to me. Oh, yeah, that you know, is Sometimes the... there's a clash, you know. And is your is he fixed? Because Smokey would not listen to this one here um, until he was fixed. And now he's he's better at listening with him. It was just me before. Yeah. Um, How about Thursday for Penny? Yeah, you got it. What time you want to do it? <coughs> Not 
yet. Okay, once once he's fixed, he's gonna be a different dog. Because you're the alpha male and he wants to be the alpha male. 6.30 my time, you got it. Thursday, 6.30 my time. Let me set that reminder. Ashes, thank you very much for your donation. I appreciate you. We did mark you down for NIFCs, two of them. Who's up next? Man, I was no. looking at my golf bag today. Mischief is up next, but she has she has uh, some for silver keys and then some for herself. Party pickle, what's going on, bud? Thanks for coming in. Appreciate you. Silver keys isn't here yet. Um, I'll set it for six o'clock. <laughs> <laughs> <coughs> I bought some BU Merc Dimes mixed dates and that matches. And if they are ones I already have, and they upgrade my album. Hey! Just in time. Oh, she was here a few minutes ago. I did not see that. Sorry, Silver Keys. Hello to you. Oh, she said hi to you too. See? Hey, what's going on? I need to do the pop-out chat so I see a, more of my chat than I do. I knew you were fishing. She said, we just got home, we were fishing. Yeah, that's what I thought. The weather was better. All right, Ashes, I got you. I'm set, I set my timer for 6 p.m. on Thursday, and uh, that'll give me a chance to get set up for a 6.30 stream. Thank you very much for being a game player with me. Uh, thanks, and how about Thursday? Got it about that. I bought some BU, got that. Just wanted to stop in for a quick moment to say hello, Party Pickle. I appreciate you very, very much. Thank you for the boom, baby. The thumbs up. Thank you. Um, probably because he's afraid of you and he won't. And he... It's smoky. Okay, but a male and a male, especially if they both got their, their jewelry, um... <laughs> It's not going to work out unless you are the sole person in the house. And as soon as the jewelry was taken off, um, Smokey was a completely different dog. He looks me in the eye. He doesn't have an attitude. He doesn't pee on stuff. It's a totally different dog. So you might need to go down that road. Hello, Big Flip. Sorry I passed out on you last night. No, hey, no problem, Silver, Silver Springs. Hey. It's all good. We just got home. We were fishing silver keys. I hope you caught lots and lots and lots of fish. Her, Thank you for being here for me. Her son caught a couple carp, but she didn't catch anything. Grass carp? Those are fun. We got run off the lake due to weather. Only got about 2.5 hours of wa on the water. I caught nothing, but my son got carps with his bow. Hey, that's cool. I always wanted a bow fish. You mean like bow bow? Yeah. <laughs> that would be cool. Don't you have to get in the water for that? No. Nope. Shoot right off the boat. All right. Who's up next? Well, we have Mischief, who has um, two rolls and a pull donated to Silver Keys for her birthday. Just in time. Hey, Silver Keys, these are for you for your birthday? From Mischief. From Mischief. And um, you will get a grab out of that bag. Hopefully, you get a 90% around of there. We'll see how it goes. Check yes. the bottom. <laughs> Got a 40% right off the bat. Big clip, the dog whisper. Um, yeah, well, I, I did work at a dog kennel as a kid, and I do know a lot about dogs. I've had a bunch of dogs in my life. Uh, I mean, a lot of dogs in my life. I can tell you all their names. I had to retire one dog to the farm because he was getting out of control. But besides that, I have personally kept every one of my dogs up until their death. So very, very neat. When I was younger and I was heading off to college and doing that kind of stuff, I had to bring my dog out to Colorado to retire on a farm out here, which wasn't a bad deal. 
My cat listens to dog not so much. <laughs> well, I've really? never, I've never had a cat that listened to myself. But here's the deal: I've never had a cat. Male cats, male cats are the way to go. They listen. Female cats will look at you when you're trying to tell them something or ask them, and like they don't know what you're saying, and they'll turn their nose up at you. You got a, that's what I found. 1968 out of that deal. Scott says, I can't take my wedding ring off. I want to email you one of our wedding pictures if you'd like. Yeah, that would be awesome. Mischief is back. All right. Mischief, we just opened the rolls for silver keys from you. And she had an ender. Uh, an ender sticker, so she got a 40 for that. And then she's going to get the pick out of this bag. Now, the entry would still go to you is for the donor drawing, unless you say otherwise. No, my <laughs> sister's farm, Scott R. Yeah, it's a legitimate farm. It didn't go to the farm. No, it's just retired on a working farm. I just watch for the radar ears. <laughs> Enter to silver keys, please. Lady Kid Nichols, how are you? Oh, so, entry to silver key. Okay. It's a 40 percenter silver keys, but I have something better for you. Um, I have a barber quarter over here. Let me see if I can get you a good barber quarter out of this deal. Ooh, it's got a little hit on the edge. Let's see if I can find a better one. This 1908 is real nice. Nope, took another hit to the face. It's I kind of like that one because of the Tony. But that one's nice too. Well, see, this one really got hit. Look at that one you just had. This 07? Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's pretty nice. The, the 09 is nice too. Let's do the 09. That 09 is nice. So I'll be sending that to you. Also, my friend, happy birthday to you. And uh, we'll get you some rolls here tonight. We'll have plenty of time for that. I have two pups. Bajan Malchi Mix. Our kids can do anything to them, but they'll bark and chase after anyone else. Well, they're doing, he says, any ideas. <clears throat> um, they're protecting, probably because of the kids. Um, I don't know how to keep dogs from barking or chasing other people. <laughs> <coughs> we got barkers, as you can tell. Yeah. Um, that's kind of their job. Silver keys for mischief. All right. Who's up now? Silver keys, thank you very much and happy birthday to you. Um, now is mischief um, with five rolls. And then 40s to 90s, and then she wants a fat bag. If there's any 40s to 90s. No marked in dirt. So you'll have a 40 on that one. Silver Keys, thank you. I appreciate you. Mischief, thank you for doing that. That's very kind of you. There was at least six 2001s in that roll.
I'm going to have to load me up a penny box, Ashes. I'm going to have to beat you up this time. You took me to school last time. Or, yeah, you won last time, didn't you? No, maybe I won last time. I don't remember. But I'm going to have to uh, sprinkle some loving in the box. I'm just kidding. You know I'm kidding. No, I'm not kidding. Yeah, I'm kidding. No, I don't know what I am. That's right. I knew he had got a coin that took him over the top. It's a buffalo. He won. No, my buffalo carried me. Ah, yeah. Eh, Scott said that caught me a little Taco Bell dog. <laughs> Yo quiero. I mean, my two-year-old can put put them in a chokehold around their necks and walk around with them, lay on them, squish them, but they don't like anyone else but us. Yep, see, that's their job is to protect you. In their eyes, they're protecting you, so anybody else, they're going to bark at. Now, chasing is probably not a good thing, but if they're good to the kids, it's all that matters. Um, all right, they're all fat bags. They're all equal except the one in the middle. The one in the middle has a roll of, it's either pennies or nickels. And it also has. If you're into that kind of. If you're into a roll of coins, then it would be number one. If you're not, then pick two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, How nine, or ten. How many points for a flying eagle in a roll? What is a flying eagle? Do, I don't even know what that is. Um, it's an automatic win. Because I've hunted hundreds of boxes and no flying eagles. So it would be one million points. No, I don't know. Look at that spreadsheet I sent you. I don't remember anymore. Let me look. Hey, we're going to get Dylan back up to... Anybody new in here? Uh oh. Oh, I'm talking Portuguese to you guys. Hold on. Okay, so let me. Is it called anything else? Is it a bird scent? Yeah, it's. Yeah, the bird scent. Oh, no, no. Flying eagle scent. 100. 100 points. Can you guys grab up this channel if the you get a chance? The bird scent is Canadian. Try and help the kid out. Five. One, two, three, four, and five. Definitely a thick one. Hey, Sherwood, what's going on, bud? Thanks for coming in. Appreciate you. Leslie, you fine folks have a great evening. Just want to stop by and show some love. Big flip, hit the thumbs up on my way in. Thank you, Les Wiley. You come back anytime. I'm glad you're feeling better. Stay yeah. Healthy. Yeah, that says ice fishing video thing. I don't know if it's ice fishing, but that is one of them. Um, I'm just trying to help them out a little bit. Okay, so, Statehood Quarter Collection. There. These have been looking really gold. It's the gold edition. No wonder they're looking gold. Illinois, <laughs> Missouri, Alabama, Arkansas, and Maine. Those will be heading to you with certificate. On top of that, you got a 2004 <laughs> SPCGS PR69D cam, Sacagawea $1, uh, last three digits 079. It is the Eagle on the back. And I will set this up. It's going to be tough for Ashes to catch this one. Maybe. And then you also got a steel scent. Oh, you got an Indian Head Penny, 1899. 
You got a 1957 out of Denver. You got a 1945 out of Denver. A 1942 out of Philly. And a 1940? PCGS 15. 46. Thank you, Ashes. Thank you, Ashes. And then you got this Indian Head Penny 1899. That will be heading to you. Thank you very much, Mister, for your donation. I appreciate you. Great pick on that bag. <clears throat> so we have CM Silver up next. CM, you're going to have to pick a box. You want a? You have both holy and regular still. Yeah. Let us know which one you want. Mischief, thank you so much. Oh, she says, thank you so much. I love it. Very welcome. Thank you. I appreciate you. Ashes, I will send that to you right now. Thank you very much, Mr. I appreciate you. All right. Now the trick is finding it. Who's up now, CM? CM, there's no marked ender in here, and this box hasn't been nice, so I'm going to hunt these real quick. If anything shows up, you can have it. If it doesn't show up, then it's say la vie, and we'll go to the box. Let me know if you want a holy box or a regular box. Morgan Monday. Yes, Morgan Monday for sure. $100 donation on Morgans. But I got some really nice Morgans in there. There's light. And then you're going to get your 40 percenters or 90 percenters. What was CM's donation? 20. Yep. Look for a box, um, holy or regular. Mm, nice picture. Nice little cabin. Very neat. That is cute little cabin. Big flip. You have an e. You have mail of the of the e kind for me. Gotcha. All right, Ash. Thank you very much, Ashes, for that. I appreciate that. There is nothing in those three rolls, so I'm going to go grab another box, and um, I'll come right down. I'm going to be away from the chat for just a minute. I am getting PayPal caught up.
Okay, I am back. <laughs> Siren is singing some good old 80 tunes. I think that's from the 80s. It'll be there before June 9th, Mikey. Oh. Ashes is the one who said Maniac, Maniac Monday from Bengals. That is an 80s song, right? <laughs> Silver Key says, great, it's stuck in my head. Yeah, it's going to be stuck in mine, too. Yeah, the good old days. I love growing up in the 80s. Well, not really growing up in the 80s. Being in my late teens in the 80s was fun. No, no, I don't know that song, Ashes, so it won't get stuck in my head. <laughs> I hear it's, it's a, I guess I'll have to get to know it. The Baby Shark song. The what? The Baby Shark song. No. We're going to have to get to know it because you're going to have a great nephew. Oh, Sean Cassidy. Yeah, I remember him. I had posters of him. Yeah, weren't all the girls crushing him? I started adulting in the 80s. Never took. <laughs> No go, not baby shark. Oh yeah. Lots of girls were crushing on him. CM, thank you very much for your donation. Good luck on your Morgan. Yes, it does, Silver Keys. AC works fantastic, but you, I'm going to go turn it off. Because you know an look, AC guy or something? I've, I've got goose bumps. That's the one thing I do know is heating and cooling. All right. Let me get caught up in the chat real quick. Great. Stuck in my head. Got it. <laughs> Thank you. We're no. With the tune changed, almost the same, but not. Have you seen the show Forged in Fire? Yeah, I have seen that real, real. That's a pretty neat show. Yeah, they make all sorts of battle axes and all sorts of stuff. I take care of the bees <coughs> for the honey. My sister has honey hives. Her hives are super healthy this year. All right, Sam, thank you very much. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 right there. Look. Two, three. You know me, I think. Two, four, six, eight, and ten. You nailed that ender, Sam. <coughs> My daughter is so adorable doing that song. 
Um, CM, I got a barber hat for you. Hey, Vern, what's going on? Thanks for coming in. Let me find you the best barber half I have. How about a 1903? That's a really neat one. I'll send that to you because I'm running out of... I have Kennedys, but um, I don't have any Benjis and I don't have any Walkers. I go to the coin store tomorrow, so I'll be getting more tomorrow. But I'm giving out all my Barbers. Hope that works for you. Thank you very much, CM, for all you do for my channel. Week in, week out. You, my friend, are a great person. Thank you very much for that. All right, let's find some silver in this thing now. Wouldn't it be nice to dump into, like, a barber dump of, like, really nice barbers in a coin roll hunt? That would be awesome. It's very expensive ferric chloride. Sorry for jumping back. But was hunting it and didn't want to take the gloves off. Um, CM says, big flip. What? Um, yeah. Yeah, I'm literally out of Benji's and out of Walker's. Not that I can't get any. I just dropped the ball and didn't pick any up. I think I'm going to have to... Oh, 20 rolls. You're absolutely correct. I'll pull another 10. And you're going to get another barber out of that deal. Oh, look at that. Back-to-back -back big flip coins with K's on them. I put my stickers over the K's. Two... Four, six, eight, and ten. It's crusty, but it's nice. It's a 1907 out of New Orleans. That one will be heading to you, too. Yeah, my dream box is to find a box full of barbers. I have found a few barbers um, in my coin roll hunting stuff, but uh, not enough to write home to mom about. We found two or three in um, a couple boxes one night, but besides that, few and far between. Check how many rolls for CM. All right, got that. Uh, sorry for jumping back. 20 rolls, got it. Ashes, thank you very much for keeping me in line. <clears throat> Another big flip. Another big flip. Another big flip. I did do that huge dump about two months ago of all the cake coins I had saved for Clush and he decided he didn't want them back so I put my stickers on them and sent them back out. I can't believe it's taken two months for them to come back around but here they are. Or at least a phone call. <laughs> hey proof. 2011 right there. That's a good sign. We have 65 up, 45 watching. I appreciate each and every one of you for being here. Let's do another giveaway. Did I say that out loud?
could you add a few of the small stickers? I'm going to buy a box when the banks open back up. I would like to put some out there for you in Oregon. Yes, you got it. I will do that. Crazy. <laughs> I got my jacket and socks and all. I'm going to do it right now. When I get done with CM, please remind me, Miss Jeff, to throw those in there or I'll probably forget when I do mailings. I go from one zone to the other and I try to do all my stuff while I'm hunting the rolls. All right, that's done right there. Look. Did you find all those? Yeah. Like back to back. Cool. I found a double header. 44D sent defective planchet error coin coin roll hunting. That is very neat. How many NIFCs, if any, did you find for CM? I've only found one proof. Okay, so no NIFC. That is an NIFC. Oh, for was that for CM or is that for nerd? This Who is CM. On? Okay. I didn't know how long it was going. Four or five <laughs> hours at least. <laughs> I couldn't I couldn't find my favorite comfy jacket so I had to find this one. It's just what he says he worked on a long, 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 long time. <laughs> Well, I am back. She naps for about three minutes and she says, oh, how long did I fall asleep for? And I'm like, well, four hours. <laughs> she just can't sleep without me. I don't Tell know her what it's Tuesday night. It is. Huh? Tell her it's Tuesday night. <laughs> I have woke up before, you know, at that weird time around six o'clock. Where it's dark out, and you're Where thinking you're waking getting... up the following morning. <laughs> yeah. All right, let me check PayPal, and I'll update that, Ashley. CM, thank you for the donation. Ashes, thank you very much for a donation. Scott R. and Gordon, thank you very much. Mischief, thank you very much. I appreciate each and every one of you. Thank you. You know who we haven't seen? Robin Detex. And T Wolf. And T Wolf, too. I um, haven't seen them in months. I had uh, mentioned something to you about it a week or a week and a half ago, and then Silver Keys was asking, too. I'm going to have to send uh, Robin Detex an email. All right, Pizza Guy says. T Wolf hasn't posted uh, it in over two months, Silver Key says. Um, pizza guy, ashes. If you're into it, I'm into it. Um, go ahead and let pizza guy have it. Tell him. What? We can fit him on the panel. That'll be fun. Oh, that would be fun. Okay, let me get the search order back. Pizza guy, I have to get the okay from the boss. Which is ashes, by the way. We'll knock the dust off that box. <laughs> Who said that? You? Pizza guy says I have a box of pennies that's collecting dust. Then he needs to hunt. How about a box battle? And ashes just told him. T Wolf hasn't posted in over two months. Yeah, and it's weird. Weird. I hope everything's okay. Pizza guy, can you do 630 Mountain on Thursday? I'll fire up the farm bird dock, the bird farm, the yard bird. Do you know how to do it without your sidekick? Yes. Okay. The reason I ask is it'll probably be out like a light by then. Chris Garner says still live. Yeah, we started at seven. Are you thinking from last night? 
<laughs> Sometimes it happens, but we never did a 24 hour one before. <laughs> um, let me see which one this one is. Oh, you had a blue shirt on last night. Oh, I am wearing a different shirt from last night. Yeah, it's just the same color, kind of. Oh, you know what? There's a silver eagle in here. There is. Oh, another silver eagle. Let me think about this. Let me check these. Thomas tripped on a nickel said, I saw T-Wolf in coin hunting couple stream a week ago for the first time in a long time. Well, hopefully everything's okay. What happened to the warning before you dumped the house? Sometimes <laughs> you get a warning, sometimes you don't. Did it scare you or uh, pierce your eardrums? Uh, this one here. Um... Yeah, we're going to pull that one out. It's just a brilliant uncirculated. We're going to set that aside. These two that I pulled out were um, silver eagles. I didn't want you to accidentally catch one of those. All right, right there. Go ahead and give me a number between 1 and 17 CM. <laughs> Brian says, I have three kids. I didn't even notice the noise. <laughs> All right, pizza guy. Yeah, let it rip, tater chip. Let us know. We will be here, though, so even the last minute, if you want to step in, you can. Just have your box ready, and uh, we'll send you an email on the scoring. Eight. Okay. Uh, matter of fact, can you send Pizza Guy that spreadsheet so he knows what's going on? Right there. It's a 1921S. Well, 1921S PCGS MS62, right there, Got a little shot right there, let me look down the road here, I want to see something here, man my phone is blowing up, yeah what's up with that? It's a 1921. If you want that 1921, I'll, I'll send you that 21. I do have an old rattler here. Well, it's not a rattler. It's an 1888. Um, I'm going to give you a choice, an either or on these. I have an 1888 out of Philly, MS63 graded way back with a green label. And then I also have an 1885O PCGS MS63. Both of those are 63s. This 1921 S that you got out of this deal was an MS62. So let me know if you want an 1888, an 1885O, or an eight, or the 1921 S that you pulled out of the box. My opinion. I'll let you see them. As a matter of fact, that's that old label. So <coughs> I'll give you time to think about it. 1888 out of Philly, the 1885 O or the 1921 S transitional year. You let me know which ones you want. And you got time to figure it out. Clever coin name, what's going on? Eighty eight P is fine as well. Um, okay, well I didn't see your first one. 
Pizza guy sent that score sheet to you. 88P. So do you want this 88P? 491? It's a gorgeous coin for sure. I would be willing to separate from that. He needs the 1888O Ashes bid, and then he said 1888P is fine as well. Oh, man, he's so fast. He needs I thought you said 88O, but P is good. So I think he wants the 88. Okay, 88P, 85O, or the 21S. But said the 88P is fine. And you know, well, maybe my, he didn't know it was an 85. Yeah, so I'll let you determine one more time. Oh, Pizza Guy, I sent you the penny score sheet. So I you can get warmed up on how exactly it's going to go. <laughs> Real ruler. I guess it's zit cream. <laughs> zit cream is incorrect. Better watch next time. Boy, my phone is just blowing up. A lot of people streaming right now. By the way, when you get a million notifications in the morning and you're sound asleep, mm -hmm. it doesn't even wake you up. Right, well, that happens all day. You want to know who it does wake up? Who? Me. I thought I turned my phone off last night, as a matter of fact. Hmm. I did trade up to XRP, um, so I have a bunch of XRP. We'll see how it 88P. goes. 88P. Huh? 88P. Yeah, it's that one right there. That's what he wants. Yep. <laughs> Heading to you, my bud. And the proof and two barber halves. Thank you very much for the donation. I appreciate you. And I hope that's all that's everything you wanted out of that deal. <laughs> Siren. Uh, he didn't come in here, I don't think. I can't remember who it was. Came from Busman's stream. Upgrade by Morgans. Upgrade my Morgans, thanks. Oh, okay. Very cool. <clears throat> CM, thank you very much for all you do for my channel. All right. What are we working on now? Nerd analyst with 20. 20 rolls for the yep. nerd? Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, two, four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Nerd, what were you doing tonight? You doing some grab bags? You doing silver pulls? You gonna do the Morgans? You looking for some gold? Let me know. Ashes C four is heading to bed. Good night, Ashes. All right, Ashes, I appreciate you very, very much for being here for me. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thanks for the help. How about a 1907 nerd? And 
1908. I will send you those two barbers if you would like, or I do have Kennedy's, or I do have 40 percenters. Let me know what you need. <laughs> All right, let's crack them open. Mischief heading out again. The pressure canner waits for no one. You're absolutely correct about that. Farva. I don't know what Lady Kid Nichols is saying out there, but she's worried about people spitting in her burger. I had a bacon burger tonight, along with a rib, before I came to hang out with you guys. Did you? Do, no, I did not. Click the winner. Just click it. Just click it. Click it. T. Love, love it. it. Congratulations. Give me a number between 1 and 10. You reset that? Not yet. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Romaine lettuce and blue cheese. A guest walks in and asks me how far is Carmel from here. I said far away. I hear your dog. Oh, talking super nice. troopers. Yeah, that's uh That's the Oakley. I bet you Miss Chip can hear her snoring. She sounds different tonight. Now it sounds like a snore. I'm pretty sure she's down a couple pounds though. Oh she is. She's um Running around and... T. Lovett, give me a number between 1 and 10. <coughs> Homemade grilled cheese fries and burgers for dinner. You, can, you eat that a lot. You've told me that a couple times. You had what is it? grilled cheese burgers and fries. Oh, you know what I should have made with that was tater tots. Okay, so today's the last day of not Two, being three, on keto because I five, fell off of six, it last seven, week again. Eight. And let me tell you, my joints hurt, my tendons hurt. It's like I can tell I've been off of keto for way too long. So going back on in the morning. You got a Canadian dime there. Nineteen sixty something, really great shape, and then you got a Sparage twenty five or nineteen fifty four with a crown on it, and the Canadian dime is really good shape. Oh, it's a sixty five. That's my that's my year. Trying to make a noise, it didn't work. <laughs> I'm trying to go, and <laughs> I just got. A and a 54. Is that my sit? No, she's a six. She's a 56. And I'm 65. Yeah. Hi, Gordon. Gordon says went back, watched the replay. Sorry, didn't realize Morgans were different tier. But if possible, could I exchange for a panda? Neighbor kid wants one. Yes. Yeah. We can do that. How are you, Gordon? How has your weekend been? Have you been off work?
I will send you this, Gordon. MS69, first strike. Last three numbers, 899, 2016, 10 yen. Gorgeous panda right there. Hope that works for you, my friend. Thank you very much for your donation. Beautiful. All right. Nerd, sorry about that. Got derailed there. <laughs> you had a coin get away from me, too. Gordon says, thank you very much. Not a problem. Thank you very much. I appreciate you. Spread? Really? <laughs> Silver keys? <laughs> um, is that like something that goes on toast or something different? <laughs> well, you know, like almond butter. Or <laughs> Got it. <laughs> Nutella. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like Nutella. Okay. Oh, yeah, see, like Nutella. <laughs> if that's what you're going with, all right. Probably going to have to plead my case for monetization on that one. Plus, I just lean by the wayside to take all the glory of the O. <laughs> yeah, I sniped that word. Sorry. Some people don't have a dirty mind all the time. No. I don't think so. Blame the hangman. Hey, hey Mike, Mike White, what's going on, bud? Thanks for coming in. Appreciate you very much. Where you been? Been on the down low, low down, no doubt. Do I need to send another email <laughs> no, with address have to it. claim it? No, we have yours. <laughs> I have that address on speed dial. <laughs> that was funny last night. I had to call Noah to wake him up to hunt his box for him. That was funny. That was funny. Your bot is the worst one in here. <laughs> <laughs> I have no control over that bot. I just put it on there and then walked away so whatever that bot does that bot does what she's saying is your bot has the worst dirty mind i get it man 70 up and no problem t love it i appreciate you <laughs> My work schedule changes frequently. What with these unprecedented times. Right. Yeah, I get it. I totally get it. I'm just telling you I'm missing you. Thanks for being here for me. I appreciate you. So we have to think about, since we just did a little fishing thing this weekend, we have to think about when we're going to go to what is that Yellowstone? No. Is it Yellowstone? Jellystone? Yellowstone. <laughs> yep. No, it's not Yellowstone. What is it called? <laughs> oh my gosh. I can't think. 
Well, we don't know what's going to happen with this thing. We're not. Really... What we really need to figure out is what day this week we're going up to the high, high lakes. Well, I thought it was going to be Thursday, but not Thursday. Um, I haven't been able to get half dollars since this all started. Yeah, I am fortunate, Mike, that I have a dump bank and then I have three other banks that help me out. And uh, I haven't missed a beat. Yeah. We haven't missed a beat on this channel. The only thing that we were missing was getting in on about $10,000 worth of silver before all this happened. And um, that's my only regret. That I didn't order a bunch of silver right when they started locking us down. It's Yellowstone. I was right. <laughs> oh, what's the one in California then? Um... Yeah, I have been fortunate for sure, for sure. Of uh, 14 boxes a week, and I haven't missed a beat. Here we go. I do know this, I've given away a lot of my slabs to the donators, but I appreciate them because without them, I had, a, I had quite the... Uh, well, I'm not going to go down that road, but Jellystone is where Yogi lives. Yeah, I know, Michael. I, that's why I said it. <laughs> I have a picture of me with Yogi Bear, the real Yogi Bear. Breeze for me. You have a good night. I love Yogi Bear. Breeze for me. Thank you very much for coming in. Appreciate you. Uh, How are you doing? Those are yours, nerd. Thank you very much, my bud. Six. And ten. Let's see what you got out of this deal. Hey, nice. You got the Marlin. Three nines fine. Raise this up so you can see the whole fish. Susie Q said just stop by because I missed a couple of your streams. I'm supposed to be sleeping. Susie Q, thank you very much for being here. I appreciate you. 2019 Marlin. It is out of the Cayman Islands. And look. The background with the queen, oh, it looks like cool. water. I like and that. a 67 40 percenter and a Mark My Dime 1916 out of Philadelphia. <laughs> very, very cool. Along with your two barbers and a 2020 one ounce. Four nines fine, silver koala, and two 40 percenters. Bank 40s, he said. Well, okay, we're going to bank the 40s. You have three of them here, so I'm going to give you another 90. There you go. One, two, three 40s. And that 90 will be this Kennedy right here. I've wanted to catch a Marlin ever since I saw the video. 15 to 20 years ago where the guy was strapped to the chair in the boat fighting one. Line got wrapped around the rod and ripped the chair right off the boat, dying all. Really? I'm going to see that video. I've always wanted to catch a big fish like that on Marlin. Here's a story tuna. for you. Gentleman was Marlin fishing and uh, he was getting a divorce or breaking up an engagement or something. And he took that his ring off his finger and he stuck it on the bill of the sailfish that he caught. I don't know if it was a marlin sailfish, whatever, I don't know. And uh, he stuck it on the bill of that fish and released the fish. And four years later, he caught that same fish back where the ring was buried into the bill of the fish. Pretty crazy. Well, it was on the internet. You no, know it has to be true, right? 
There was a viral video before there was YouTube. Spread via email. I bet you it's still out there now. Nerd, I hope that works for you. Two Barbers, a Kennedy 64, 1916 Merc Dime, and then you got the Sailfish, and you also got the 2020 Panda. Thank you very much for your donation. I appreciate you. Sailfish is very, very neat. Thanks for the fidget spinner you added to my package. That was a riot. It has a place on my desk. Susie Q, yeah, that's what happens is um, those fidget spinners, and I'm telling you what, you can't break those things. I broke one. I stuck compressed nitrogen to it, put it in this vise and set it up so that the nitrogen hit that thing, and it made it go so fast that it blew up. It was pretty crazy. But him, I did do it, our, and then I had to do it again. Him and, and our son was in the garage laughing, so I knew they were up to something. No uh, safety goggles. She's never owned one before. <clears throat> Nerd, thank you very much for your donation. I appreciate you very much. Right there. T. Lovett, right there. Thank you very much. What do we got now? Coinster for 10? Yep, 10 rolls. It's the last 10 right here. I timed your spinner <clears throat> over three minutes one time when I let my nieces play with it. Yeah. Wow. I wish I had a fidget spinner. I'd spin it right now, but I don't I have one down here. Well, I have a whole bucket of them. Oh, yeah, I got one. Let's do another giveaway. Let's do a fidget spinner giveaway. And I'm going to spin the fidget spinner. And when it's over, I'm going to pick a winner. Ooh. That sounds fun. F I D G E T. Is Can that I answer correct? This one? No, you can't ever enter one. <laughs> yeah, but you've never seen this on a channel fidget spinner giveaway. Crazy. Did you start the fidget oh. spinner? <laughs> Panic. Panic. <laughs> Coinster right here, my bud. Thank you very much for the donation. You did catch one. Let me see what I got. I have a barber here. How about... How about a 1912 barber? I will send you. Got a little bit of black there. See, I think that's a silver test right there on that, on his head. And then somebody scratched his cheek. But if you want that, I can send it to you. Oh, it's out of San Francisco. Remember, you can only enter one time um, with one of your channels. You can't use other channels. Jenny Forrest, what's going on? Channels. Thanks for being here. Or 1911 doesn't have anything going on with it. You can have that one if you want that one. The 1912 is nicer, but it just has that cheek scratch. Let me know which one you need. I like the character of that barber. All right, you got it. Looks like it's barely gonna make two minutes. One minute 40. Come on, come on, come on. It isn't trying. 
bad spin. Yeah, it happens. I panicked. <laughs> Susie Q says, after the fidget spinner, I don't even remember what was in my package. <laughs> <laughs> Clever coin name. Congratulations. You are going to get to have some foreign silver tonight. One, two, three, four, five, six, <laughs> seven, eight, nine, ten. There's ten bags here. <laughs> Silver Keith says, well, the older the fidget spinner, the less time it goes. <laughs> two minutes, 28 seconds, nerd says. Hey. Give me a number between <laughs> one and ten. Um, clever coin name. Hey, that's my name. You're absolutely correct. I featured it in my mail call. Will you write that down for me? What? Susie Q's mail call. Oh, yeah. One, two, three, four, five, and six right there. This channel bought $460 worth of Four and silver for you guys. <laughs> Happens to the best of fidget spinners, she says. She's kind of crusty, but in really good shape. Ten cents out of Canada. So a lot. Is that toning? Is that? Um, I don't know. Nineteen sixty-seven. It's about where it sat for years, and then a uh, ten. Something or other. <laughs> Nerd Analyst says, as we get older and as it gets later, how we find humor regresses. <laughs> Looks like a 1918 to me. I can kind of make it out there. But that's coming to you, my friend. <laughs> Silver Key says, She's kind of crusty. Only this channel. And she's got the forehead flap. My first one here and second one ever. Well, those are coming to you, my bud. Thank you very much for that. Make sure I'm going to put my email up. Will you please make sure that I have... Oh, I almost so bumped it. So it's the foreign end at Fidget Spinner? No. I, I can't mail a Fidget Spinner. Oh, see, I thought that's what you were giving away was this Fidget Spinner. Do you want to give him the Fidget Spinner? Well, when you said fidget spinner giveaway, I thought it was for a fidget spinner. Did you guys think it was for a fidget spinner? Well, fine. You get to ship No, I it. was just wondering. There's my email right there coming up. Ash just says, how many fidgets could a fidget spinner fidget if a fidget spinner could spend fidgets? Wait a minute. Ashes is still in here? I thought you See, checked Sil out. Silver Key said yes, fidget spinner. She thought it was a fidget spinner. Okay, too. seal that up. Smokey, you're all right. You're all right. You're okay. Good boy. There's the fidget spinner. Make sure you give me an address in the email. And please put the address in the exact form so I can just copy and um, paste. I appreciate you very much. Oh, and I'm supposed to put stickers in Mischief's bag. All right. Mischief says I thought so too. All right, we sent it. It's gone. Also, my address is the same as Lady Kid Nichols, so you can just send it there. Oh, that's right. That's her other half. Who? Clever coin name. But do us a favor, can you email that again? Because with it related to your name. Because we'll forget come tomorrow. I said I would lurk some ashes. Oh. Yes, there is a comment video, and I will post that again. Probably several more times here. Oh, Beyonce now. When's the big date? 
TM from Fly Fly, Fidget Spinner. Say la vie, Fidget Spinner. Siren says, Smokey, grab a Fidget Spinner and send it to me. Who said that? Siren. Siren, you don't have a Fidget Spinner? Didn't you get a fidget spinner last <laughs> week or? Yeah, nerd analyst. I help him with his, his mailings anyway. Most of the time. Tomorrow probably not because I have to go into work. So he'll probably be doing those. All right, once again, we got derailed. Coinster, I'm sorry. <laughs> the bid date is not set. Oh, the, what do you call that? When you date stamp it? You didn't date stamp that one? Who said that? <laughs> Oh, okay, no, okay, the date is not set, because I had asked about the date, so they were talking about fiance, and then Lady Kid said, Psh, don't go talking about date yet, flip side. <laughs> yeah, I said yes, she said, well, congratulations. Sucker. <sighs> My... Family gave me Colombian coins I found in 1972 10 centavos DDO and the 75 10 centavos DDO. You're always finding stuff like that. Man, that's close. They almost polished that thing out of there. Oh, no, it's. Because I started it. Sorry, coins. <laughs> Fidget spinners will do that. He asked me to marry him last week. That is. Awesome. Have you watched the song he wrote for Shibby on my channel? No. No. I'm going to write that down. I did bump into it, but I didn't have time to watch it, or I think I was in my truck, or I was doing a run around or something. I'm writing it down right now. We'll do that right after. I know it had Shibby a little choked up. Yeah, no adult jokes on here, Mike. I got a, I got a strike for something in a stream a couple weeks ago. We don't know what it was, right? Right. Um, check PayPal one more time. Let me know if I can close this out. Checking. Oh, you saw three? Mm-hmm. You were caught up after Coinster. Thank you for the email. Um, Clever coining, just so when we look it up, we'll remember. <laughs> we may not remember it when we have 50 packages in front of us. Seventy six likes. 
Nerd says we made it. Let's see if we got this kid back up to 80 again. He's at 80. Can you guys, anybody new in here that didn't go over and grab this channel up, can you click here on the linky? And um, go over and bust this kid up. You know, it's something cool to do, and he's worked on his channel really hard. I knew him as a youngster, and I bumped into him on the tube. It was just crazy. I just bumped into him, and uh, I knew him, so... It's pretty crazy when that happens. <laughs> oh, real, real ruler. Thank you for trying to find it. What are you trying to find? That Marlin chair thing he was talking about. Did you find the wedding ring thing? Did you look that no, one up? That's what he was looking for. Oh. Oh, no, no. No, he wasn't. No, he looking was looking for the broken chair. Yeah, that the goes chair. In the water. All right. Um, so, did you want to grab out of those slabs over there with the s silver eagles and the pandas, or did you want to do silver pole? Let me know. Grabs, please. Got you. Well, we had kind of separated them, the fat ones from the skinny ones, which I don't know if it's proper, but so... There is two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 19. There's 19 bags here. Go ahead and give me two numbers. One and 19. Thank you very much for that. I appreciate that. Well, I'll tell you one thing. There's a lot of videos about people getting pulled over by the Blue Marlin. Those are two Brad, nice bags. Holy night, moly. Guys. Back to work early in the morning. Yeah, I think I'm going to head out early to go to work too. Hey, that's cool. Look at that stuff. Wow. Really? Yeah. That was... All right, and this first bag that got this little teeny chunk of silver right there a is a 45 Philly, a 41 Philly, a 47 Denver, a 54. Five Denver, a 51 Denver, and those were wheats, and then a 1935 um, Buffalo Head Nickel out of Philly, and then a 64 quarter out of Denver. In the mint wrapper. And then you got an Eisenhower. Proof. Nice. And then your second bag, you got a roll of 2009 Lincoln Cents. It is the Capitol Building. With a double obverse roll that will be heading to you. You got a 2004S Sacagawea a PR69 decam, 985, last three digits. Really, really neat. I think we looked one up earlier and it was 12 bucks. That will be heading to you. On top of that, you got a 76 silver quarter in the mint wrapper. And you ended up with a 
40... Forty-nine out of San Francisco, another thirty-five uh, Buffalo head nickel, a forty-five wheat cent out of Philadelphia, a nineteen fifty. This thing almost looks woody. Said Woody. Fifty-one Denver. An uncirculated wheat scent. It's a 1940D. And last but not least is a 45 Philadelphia. And don't forget your barber half. It's called wood grain. Oh. <laughs> I thought, well, okay. Uh, I'm not going there. <laughs> I didn't say a word. Me neither. I just did the whole face slap thing. In person. Oh, and there goes another. <laughs> <laughs> yep, that's the one, Silver Keys. That's the one. Coinster, no, thank you very much. I appreciate you. Did you put that? Toy Story, yeah, that's right. That was that doll's name. Did you guys get this kid up there again? 81. Somebody got him. I appreciate you guys for doing that. Archaeology Mikey, you have a good evening. He has got to go to bed. He says, midnight there in Maryland. Thank you very much, Mikey, for being here. Thank you for all your knowledge. I appreciate you. I think I better wrap that. So, in any way, what I was saying is we got to start thinking about when we're going to head towards Yellowstone. Yeah, Probably you know, August, huh? July, maybe. When, when we go to see Silver Keys, is that what you're yeah. really worried about? <laughs> I know we can't do it yet. Yeah, here. <laughs> <laughs> Coinster, thank you very much. And the fidget spinner fell in there too, my bud. Thank you very much for your donation. I appreciate you. All right, I think we are wrapped up. We are. Let me put that comment video out again. Yes, he did. It happens around here. So if you guys have not made uh, done a comment on that comment video, um, please take a moment and do that and get into the in the stream. And so you know what I have not done was the wheel, which will take me just a couple minutes. <laughs> I'm gonna shovel some coins. I'll do that. Okay. Okay, bear with me, you guys. If you see a change in the picture, I am trying to find the the right stream deck button to press. Ah, 
Ah, there it is. <coughs> I am actually setting the wheel up so I will not be able to see the chat. All right, so on the wheel and a big thanks to Pammy Jones. Um, we have Miss Chith, we have Silver Keys um, birthday um, what do you call it? Birthday entries, I guess. <laughs> um, then we have Gordon, thank you, Scott R, Ashes, Miss Jeff. CM Silver, Nerd Analyst in Coinster 2289. You are all on the wheel. <clears throat> Going to double check your entry numbers. All right. Okay, the wheel is set up. <clears throat> I forgot the silver keys, mm -hmm. the rolls. <clears throat> yes, silver keys on the wheel. I'll put silver keys on the wheel for five more. We're going to donate a grab bag to her. Okie dokie. Okay, so I'm going to take hers that has two, and I'm going to increase it. Or do you want a second pie? You're going to increase it. Well, we'll give her a second slice. Who else had a birthday in here? Anybody? Um, coin. Silver keys, Somebody I'm going to give you. Saturday. Who was it? Silver Keys, I'm going to give you a grab bag tonight for your birthday um, because you're a moderator in here. So I need Ashes C Forded. Yeah, I get Ashes a lot. <laughs> it's crazy how many birthdays that guy has. Silver Keys, give me a number. That's number one, and this is number 50. Go ahead and give we me a did, number. There was another person with a birthday on Saturday, and I'm trying to remember who it was. Two, one. Well, two, three, four, and five. Swing and a miss. I'm very sorry. But, you know, Big Flip's got you. I need a sticker. <laughs> what? 
Congratulations on finding that ender. Two 40 percenters heading to you. You do have another 40 over here in your bag of tricks. Um, here. Uh, no, that one's got initials in it. I'm going to send you this one. Instead of those 240s, it's a 1911 Barber. Lady Kid Nichols, thank you very much for that super chat. I appreciate you very much. So that, I'm going to swap out for those 240 percenters. So you got a Barber coming your way. Whatever Lady Kid Nichols had in your pack for you. And then I'm going to hunt these rolls. Max says it was his birthday. That yours wasn't the, well. Happy birthday, but yours wasn't the one I was thinking of. Who was that? Max Selleck. Says my birthday was yesterday. No, it wasn't a few weeks ago. That was Hudson's. Hudson's his son. Susie keeps gonna have two next year because hers was in March, right when the pandemic lockdown started. Yeah, that's a bummer. His was in that time frame, too. Mine was April 7th. Yeah, so it's a, kind of a bummer for him. But we made up for it. Are you thinking of Big Mike? Big Mike? I don't know who we're thinking of. Yes. Yes, it was, it was Big Mike. And it was Saturday, right? Big Mike, you had a birthday on Saturday? Matt said just dropping in to say hi. I would love to spend my birthday yesterday with y'all, but I was busy. What did you do, uh, Max, for your birthday? Big Mike, yep. Big Mike was yesterday. So we'll open some rolls. Well, Silver Keys, you did get a barber out of that deal. Now, <laughs> can you hear the gears grinding? Silver keys, do you want a grab bag or a big flip coin? Ooh. <laughs> hey, Shibby, what's going on, bud? Thanks for coming in. Appreciate you. Well, that's cool, Max. Yeah, it's really hard right now to be able to do anything. You want a deer or an eagle? Kelly Ray, what's going on? Thanks for coming in. Appreciate you. <laughs> Culver Farm Blog, thank you very much for coming in. Appreciate you very much. Ash just says, whatever you do, just time stamp it. It is indeed the shipster. Yes. Yeah, we're waiting on deer or an eagle. Deer is fine. All right. Yes, dear. <laughs> oh, smoky boots. Smoky boots. Wait, no. Nope. Whoa, Stay what's there. going on there? Huh? Get down. Get down. Get down. What are you doing? Get I don't down. know, but he was going to walk on this. It's crazy. I know. I was losing it. Wiggle bum. Shibby says, dog, but hey, Shibby. What's going on, Shib? 
Yes, that was Smoky Boots. You get a jump start on your mailing, Shibby? Fort Jenny says, I think he winked at me. That is Smoky Boots, the father of the two pups that we have. The two pups' names are Rusty Wiggles and Honey. I call her Honey Bear. Oh, yep, he jumped, jumped up. He was... Look. Little, little wiggle. <laughs> <laughs> little wiggle butt. <clears throat> he, he just is a little ham. <clears throat> Silver Keys, happy birthday. <clears throat> <laughs> Jenny says, the thing is, I winked back. <laughs> Sixty-two of one thousand. Backside winked. Yep, I got about seventy-five percent done. We'll finish and go drop off in the morning. Hey, you're way ahead of the curve. Oh, you know I wasn't worried about my stuff. I was just. You know, thinking. He's oh. got mailings to do tomorrow, too. Silver Keys, no, thank you very much. I appreciate you. If I get to work early enough, I might be able to finish before my physical therapy appointment and then come back here and do my meeting. We have all day to get them done. They don't leave our post office until after 5 anyway. You can just get them done. I will. I'll start them early. Yeah, that's what I was hoping. Silver Keys, thank you very much. Big Mike, five rolls for you, my bud. Let's see what's going on. Hey. Should be reference. I sent your stuff to Ashes. Oh. Who he's talking to, though. Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> You yelled at me yesterday. Did he? What'd you do? Oh, did you mark this down for silver keys, please? Oh, I did not. As a matter of fact, I didn't even put it in. Silver Keys has two in the bank. Really? Mm hmm All right, I'll put another 40 in there for you, Silver Keys. That'll give you three. I'm going to cross that off. And your bank is now clear. Yes, it's, we're towards the end here, Scott. Couple birthday rolls right now, my bud. We got Max Selleck coming up after this. One of these days when I go, 
big and growed up like Shibby Rob, I'll find an OFG too. Big Mark, um, you did get a 40%er out of that, so look for that in the mail. Right here, my butt. And next up, Max Selleck. I'm going to give you five rolls, too, my friend. One, two, three, four, and five. It would be nice to find some silver in these rolls. Got skunked on silver tonight, but we did get some NIFCs. Yeah, we we'll donation oh, lineup didn't. stack deck. Well, uh, we're, we got a box out here. If he wants to go down that road, we'll just hunt him. Um, you would be up. Oh, please. Okay. Um, when you're done with those rolls, I gotta. Um, and you know what? I'll have to check. So. Well, I'll check first. No, no, no. Oh. I have it one way or the other. Okay. I just have to see what's in the slab box. Y'all are like little kids at the playground. Lady kid says, yes, absolutely correct. Max Selleck, there was nothing in your rolls. I'm very sorry, my butt. But happy birthday anyway. Says cut 13. All right, looks like we're still going. We have another donation. It was just kidding on almost done. <laughs> well, we are still almost done. <laughs> um, is there a man here that doesn't qualify as a man child? Let that man be whatever it is a man, man is. <laughs> okay. Clever coin name. Um, now, you'd have to get the opinion of the women around the men. <laughs> Shitty. I don't know where 13 is. As a matter of fact, watch out. Let me see if... <laughs> Silver Key says, that's my coin there. Yes, that one. <laughs> Let me see. I don't know if 13 fell out there. Smoky Boots, why are you up here again? You're looking for this? Come on, get down. 
Come on. He said cut 13 on it. There's a monster premium behind 13, though, Shib. Like, it's almost, you almost can't. Ex Shib or, what are you talking about? Oh, okay, so you're doing something different. I thought you were going to do the 13 on on Halloween. Or yeah, I'm not Friday doing the 13th. It, no. Or something like that. Okay, so we have two donations. We have the pizza guy up next with 10 rolls. And then we have a donation for Clever Coin Name from Lady Kid Nichols for 10 rolls. And her message is, good luck, Clever. I love you with a little heart. Aw, that's so cute. Yep, that's your name. I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't keep an eye on thirteen. Ash, it says when I get one, I would like seven seventy-seven. It's in the silver pulse. It's crazy. I can't believe that slipped out of there. What's that? I'm gonna recover it tonight if nobody gets it. What? Oh, 13's in the 13's box? 13's in this box. When you get 313 Big Flip coin, and I would love to have that one, it's my birthday. Mm. We'll probably be a couple months away from that, but um, just, hey, fix that I'm dog. I'm going to fix that dog. What kind of wanted number two because... Where did you put your ball now? <laughs> do that. Um, number two went already. All right. Kind of wanted number two because, you know, it's important. <laughs> so who, who's up now then? Is she going to neuter that dog? He's already neutered. What's happening is he keeps throwing his, his um, ball in... Uh, a box or a garbage can or somewhere and then he just sits there and yipes <laughs> pizza guy says okay i'll be here i can wait actually was, <laughs> you know what i think i think that paypal should give everyone a free bank account with a hundred dollar free money to buy rolls so i wish i could donate and have rolls on my own instead of watching others yeah max i get it um i did a no lot of giveaways um when i was first um, coming into this community, I would buy rolls and then give them out, and like Scott R does a lot, and uh, it was very, very neat to be able to do that. And that's why I started my channel up so that I could give um, on my channel and not so much give away in other channels. Who's up first? Pizza guy. Pizza guy. Mm -hmm. Ten rolls. Mm -hmm. Pizza guy. What were you gonna do? Were you gonna grab out of that slab box, or you gonna do silver pole? Um, what's going on with you, my dude? My pizza dude. Are you going to put Silver T's coin away? I already did. Oh, you did? Okay. I want to make sure. 
Silver Keys' coin is already put away. Okay. I just saw one up there, so I thought... Uh, Pizza Dude. <laughs> I can Silver give Keys you... Almost had her there. Well, you know, I just never know. I can give you two barber quarters, or I can give you this barber half, but it does have an initial in it. Or I can find you a Kennedy or Walker after the fact. You let me know what you want to do. This is my last barber. It does have initials in it. I don't know. Why would, would somebody do that? Do that? Oh, that's crazy. But you let me know what you want, and I will get it for you. That barber is out of San Francisco, by the way. I still have a copper round I won from you in your second or third stream on my dresser, so I see it whenever I get ready in the morning. Real ruler, that is totally cool. Matter of fact, I have a lot of copper rounds still from those days that I haven't brought out. I'll take that barber. There's an A and an N there. Can I get a slab for the 10 roll donation? Yes, you can get a slab. It's going to be either a American Silver Eagle or a Panda slab. And I have to I have to check something here. Kelly Ray says, I love copper rounds. <clears throat> we haven't given away copper rounds in a long time. And you know what? The slab pandas are gone. American Silver Eagles is all I have. And they are all the same. Or I have one commemorative in here that you can ask for if you get there. Or we can do a silver pole. It's up to you. Um, what are these? Let me see. Yeah, so Pizza Guy, you let me know. Pizza Guy, did you get a big flip around yet? Hey, Gear is awake. Hey, Gear. Thank you very much for coming in. I appreciate you. No, but for regular slabs, you can. For the Morgan, oh, yeah, thank you very much for that. Appreciate it, Silver Keys. ASC would be great. You got it. I can already show it to you if you Come want. Come on, let's find some silver. We've got a second chance to find silver here and not get skunked. Hey. What? him chewing on his ball. It is? Yeah, he's because it's broken <laughs> and it makes a funny noise. No, you guys, we can't play ball right now. You guys bark too much. Mm -mm. Nope, I love you. Nope. Oh. He's so sweet. Dremel, bam, no more tube. <laughs> Get out of here, Clever Coins. You did not. <laughs> uh, that gave me goosebumps. <laughs> I'm just thinking about that. Uh, no. Clever Coin names, that's prove it. <laughs> <laughs> no, you prove it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> No, he certainly did not. <laughs> oh, can you imagine the pain? Mm-mm. 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 Mm There was a guy who lived west of me who, when I was in college, did his 
own root canal and cap the tooth with a rock from his driveway that he shaped with his Dremel. Was he a dental student? I mean, how did he know? Oh, a rock? It can, it's possible. No, it's not. There, no. You don't think that's possible? Oh. <laughs> okay. Or am I just gullible? <laughs> I don't know, but I'll tell you this. <laughs> that would be crazy. Lady Kid says, real ruler, I actually do believe that. I kind of believe that can be possible. He doesn't, but I do. Stack Deck says. I don't know why you'd want to do that. Um, I will check Stack Deck. Stack Deck, thank you very much. You will be after Clever Queen Name. Oh. your ears. Absolutely nothing in those rolls, pizza guy. But, um, pizza guy, did you make your decision? Do you want this with the initials in it, that barber? Or did you want two quarters? Or did you want a 90? Or did you want three forties? How do you want to go about that? And then this will be your slab. No need to pick a number. 2016 PCGS MS69 30th anniversary first strike. I hope that works for you, my bud. Last three digits 346. It is a gold label. You got it. <laughs> Claire Pointing said, okay, well, real ruler, I'm out. I was kidding. You have got the prize for terrible Dremel home dentistry story. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, there you go. I almost don't have a slab 2014. I got a few more. Getting close to not having one? <laughs> yeah. Jimmy says, hmm, sorry, when I tell the dice to roll, they roll. Did you win? Pizza guy, thank you very much. That barber's in there, my friend. <laughs> I pass on going to the dentist when I'm supposed to get a normal cleaning. Well, you shouldn't because then you won't be there as often to get other stuff done. That's my problem. So I go on every and something six hurts. months. Every six months, you should go get it cleaned. Thank you, pizza guy. I appreciate you. Clever coin Maybe name. Ten rolls. Lady Kiss says, "Now I have Steve Martin singing the dentist song stuck in my head from Little Shop of Horrors." Horrors. One, two. Three. I'm sorry, you can either have two barber quarters or you can have three 40 percenters. Let me know. That's me. Good luck to you. The dentist get from Carol Burnett with Harvey Corman and Tim Conway. You know, I kind of remember that. 
with with Tim Conway pulling Carol Burnett's tooth? You know, I used to watch the Carol Burnett show with my mom all the time. 1905 Barber Quarter and a 1907 Barber Quarter. Those are coming to you, my bud. Best stuff right there. Yeah, yeah. And he was like standing on the chair and she was all like, yeah, I remember that. I can't believe you used to watch the Carol Burnett show. I don't well, remember it was back when those shows, we didn't have cable, remember? It was get what you get. It was stand up, walk over the TV, turn the channel, click, 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 click. If you had the channel thing still. Or Otherwise, if you wore it out like we the did. The pool you had, cue you had, no. from across the room. No, I'm talking about before you could push a button when you had to go click, 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 and then oh. it would wear out. And you have to have the little pliers on there. You guys have to go watch it. It's great. I bet we could YouTube that even. Probably. <coughs> I'm aware of the Carol Burnett show. I don't know if that counts for anything. <laughs> the dentist office you, name is Tim Conway, yeah. You know, that's, that was a different kind of funny. That was, that was real funny stuff back then. I used to love watching Saturday Night Live. You know, I don't watch it anymore, but the old stuff back late 70s, so funny. Rocky Horror Picture Show, yeah, I did go see that one time. I just wasn't that guy that got involved with that stuff and dressed up and went down and did that. Plus, I was kind of young. I was, well, yeah, when I saw years. it, <laughs> I was like 12 or something. I wasn't able to go all by myself. Yeah, that's right. We were the remote control. That's why America was thinner back then. No remotes. <laughs> and we got kicked out of the house to go play outside. Mm. Silver Keys put the skit up there. I don't think I can put that on there. No, you can't. Mm. Yeah, we might have to take that off. What do I use for videos? I use I, my I, I use my Streamlabs OBS. I brought then, it up and saved it. Thank you for bringing that up. I'm going to watch that later. And then for editing, it's Camtasia. And then my down is a universal camera holder phone holder customized um with tape i really need to get that camera down in here further but if i bring it down in here see that camera sits right here <laughs> this is the lens right here look you can hey, see it five nine fine how are you welcome actual humor is what you have so if I drop it down here further you'll see it from this camera you'll see it from this one Kelly Ray says my dentist name is Tim Conway oh, that's funny so I'm gonna have to find a way to get it down in here further without this camera coming into effect um, yeah the one I'm pointing at now that's looking at me this one will be in its way if I drop it down any further that's kind of one of the snags but it's just a, a pedestal adjustable up and down and I use it in the garage when I pour silver and things like that um, and it's uh it was basically made as to be a phone holder on a pedestal and then I converted it over and put my my uh, my Logitech camera in it did you see we have five nine five stepped in no I did not where's that at Hey, 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 five nine fine. What's going on? Thanks for coming in. Actual humor as well as n not just Trump jokes. <laughs> what do you use for a video? Okay, got that. Yeah, well, um, this crowd is a little wild. Um, I have to keep them under control. <laughs> they uh, they get a little crazy in there. 
And this is a great place to hang out, by the way. We just kind of do our thing. We don't play by the regular rules around here. Well, we play by a lot of rules, but not the regular ones. <laughs> okay. Hey, Five Nine Fines, thank you very much for being here. I appreciate you. Clever coin name. What would you like? Would you like a silver pole, or you want one of those American silver eagles out of that box? Or... Great, thanks, new viewer. Grab bags. Don't mean to make waves, just agree with your take on SNL. Yes. No. We, uh, you're not making waves. That's awesome. We're glad you're here. <laughs> yeah, I just, I haven't watched him lately. I haven't watched Saturday Night Live. Saturdays are a day to get stuff done around the house and so forth. And usually I'm so tired. Um, I don't make it up as late as that anymore. Clever. You get two of these grab bags. 3, 6, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. There's 19 grab bags here. No, no, no. Remember? What? Oh, no, I don't remember. I got a lot going on over here. Let me see what I can find. We're not, we're not doing grab bags. Yeah, you can't have a grab bag. <laughs> oh. Since this is from Lady Kid Nichols to Clever Coin, correct? Right. And she would like them to have one of those. Right. All right. Oh, koala. <laughs> I don't have koala slabs, I don't think. Is that mic muted? Because we don't need it to be muted. We no, don't it's, need it. it's not muted. I gotta, I'm going to have to hunt. Give Hang on, give, give him a second. He has to look for what he's looking for. Thank you, all. new collector. The coin community is good people. Five, nine, fine. We... You know, we joined this community almost two years ago, and we absolutely love it. And why do I have a circle of death here? Anybody else having trouble? Oh, there we go. I'm back. Come up here, bring your ball. Nope, nope, nope. Look, you're giving them the butt wiggle again. Come on, get down. Come on. No, you didn't. You didn't hear anything. Nothing, I say, nothing. <clears throat> We did not go through emails today, um, but we will this evening.
If you have not gone and commented for the end of stream giveaway, I am posting that link a couple more times here. Oh, yes, we will do that here. Here wants the tracking number. Okay, yeah, I'll send it to you, my bud. Ten weeks. Silver Key says, congrats on the ten weeks of not smoking. Thank you very much. Ten weeks, that is awesome. All right, so I found it. Found it. It is the Five of Diamonds. This will be heading to you. i got to pull this card out here. What am I doing? Uh, I can do whatever I want, apparently. <clears throat> two 40 percenters. Fast and Furious 20. <laughs> On top of the two barbers, first 40 percenter is a 65, second one is a 68. And then on top of that, you are getting a Koala 2020 Four Nines Fine One Ounce Silver Koala. That will be heading to you also, my friend. On special request. Yeah, there was a special request behind From it there. Your... I didn't absorb it very good for a little bit, but I finally <laughs> got her got her dialed in. <laughs> So you got quite a bit of silver there. Thank you very much for that donation. I appreciate you. Will you file that and quit yelling at me? <laughs> Clever coin I'm name. Like, no, no. Congrats to you, Clever Coin name. Handy Brothers, what's <clears throat> going on? Thanks and for you coming will, in. You will get your entries into the um, donor drawing also. <clears throat> Thank you so much, Lady Kid Nichols, for that. Stack Deck, thanks for your patience. You are up next. <clears throat> Thank you very much. I appreciate you. Man, I got a lot of mailings to do. All right, Stack Deck. Five rolls for Stack Deck. That'll happen when um, all the donations are over and we've done the donor drawing. <clears throat> we never know when that's. That is. We thought it was a while ago. We thought it was going to be an hour ago. <laughs> we never know. Lady Kid, you're you're the best. Thank you very much. <laughs> Siren's throwing me squirrel farts. So what's going on? <laughs> <laughs> Five rolls. Stack deck, you did catch it. You got two 40 percenters coming, my bud. Two 40 percenters, or do you want a barber quarter? Let me know. Oh, What did she do? Oh, she did not. No, we did the, the, it's a trap, yep. We did the 75, right? I don't know if we did or not. 75 light? I don't know. No, I doubt it. We didn't do the 75 light? Uh-uh. All right. Let me see if I can find one. No, I don't think we did 75. How about a 1910 Barber? I do It's a Barber 80. Quarter. We did not do the 75 like. That yes. Barber Quarter is in place of your 240 percenters, my friend. Thank you, Siren. Oh, I'm typing in the wrong one. Oh, yeah. Five nine five. When you um, enter this giveaway, it's going to be exclamation giveaway space one, the number one. Um, you should have coins. If you don't, I will get you some. So give it a try. No, we did do one last night. Did one what? A 75. So I remember writing it. That was, um, 
I don't remember who it was, but it's on their little bag over there. Who asked about last night? Remember, Who's... you can only enter once um, with one of your channels. Mischief said, I must have missed it. Oh, well, that's okay. <laughs> I don't know how to say that name. There you go. You got it. Let's see if it... Yep, it saw your entry. Oloco, thank you very much for coming in. I appreciate you very much. All right. Stack deck. Didn't play well. I think there's 18 bags here. Go ahead and give me a number. That's number one and that's number 18. Thank you very much, old <laughs> local. I, I appreciate you very much. Susie Key says, I'm seriously going to bed after the drawing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and eleven. Good luck to you, my friend. We saw this last night. It's pretty crazy. <clears throat> it's a Cheerios penny from 2000. Is that crazy? You can only enter with one of your channels. If you win and you have more than one channel, we will not be able to send it. 1936 S MS 61 red brown penny $2.50 penny 1937 Buffalo head nickel of course your barber quarter I don't know what that is it's got a little little something on it Fifty three out of Denver. If forty six out of Philly. Forty four out of Philly. And a forty five out of Philly. And then you also got a nineteen oh one Indian head penny. And a two thousand four S PCGS D Cam PR sixty nine. Last three digits, 541. It is a Sacagawea proof. $1. We scanned them earlier, and they're about a $12 slab. So, the slab, the MS61 RB, the Barber Quarter, the Cheerios Penny, the Buffalo Head Nickel, and five, four wheat cents, and an Indian Head Penny. Thank you very much, my friend, for your donation. I have two, but only log in one. Perfect. Who's that? Susie Q. And she's still awake, by the way. <laughs> Blonde looked at a bowl of Cheerios and said, Oh my gosh, bagel seeds. <laughs> really? Real ruler? Is that what's happening? <laughs> Stack deck. Thank you very much. I appreciate you. Right there. Gregory Lee, what's going on, bud? If 
phone's dying. If I leave, I'll be right back. All right, Scott R. Thank you very much. <clears throat> Southern Metal. Uh, oh, there you are. People have time for two channels. <laughs> Well, I have two channels, and I don't have time for my second one. I'm trying to find some time. I have a bunch of subscribers, though. At least a hundo. Okay. All right. The phone is dying. If I leave, I'll be right back. Um, make, are you ready? Yeah, go down and make sure that Scott got in there. Yeah, he did. Can I pick it? Oh. Yes, you can pick it, but Scott... We'll be back. Are you going to let it go the other minute? I opened it back up. Oh, you did? Yeah. Is everybody in this thing? Get in it. Alexa, set timer for 30 seconds. If you've 30 already... Seconds. Starting now. If you already got in it, you don't need to do it again. <clears throat> hey, thank you very much, Gear, for posting that. I appreciate you. <laughs> Alexa, dismiss. Boom, Mike White. Congratulations. Give me um, a number between one and ten. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Ah. Hey, that's me. Thank you very much for doing that, my bud. I appreciate you. Mike White, give me a number between one and ten, my bud. You can tell Ashes is on the phone because it says congrats six. It always does that to me when I go to hit the okay or, you know, above the letters where you just hit the, the word and I accidentally hit the six. I do that all the time. Thank you very much, Susie Q. I, I appreciate you very much. You might want to hang around. We're going to do that giveaway right now. Um, after we get done with the 75 likes, number seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Ooh, let's see what you got. Good night, Susie Q. Lady Kid Nico says, I'm oh, always on my phone. Slick date. <laughs> she says, oh, you. And another something or other. What? Crazy. But I'm going to fix it. I don't even know what that thing is. These are two of the crustiest coins I've seen. Yeah, I'm not too fond of those. It's a 1901. Um, I think it's out of the Philippines. Foreign silver, yeah. And I'm going to pick it. That is a 10 centavo. 0 0.902. And somewhere on there it tells you Gramos. But that's a neat coin. And let me grab one more. I'm going to kill a foreign silver bag. Oh. Mike White, because I appreciate you. There's the Helvetia coin right there. Really nice. <coughs> 1952 half franc. That will also be coming to you. Thank you very much. Will you write Mike White on there for me? I sure will. 
A Swiss. Yeah, Helvetia. It is a nice coin. Man, I tore my hands up this weekend. Holy moly. <laughs> you tore your legs up, your hip up. <laughs> it was a rough sport playing at the lake this weekend. In okay. In the backyard. Let's do the... Let's do the donor giveaway. Do we for, have no. Mike's information? Or do you want to put your email? Yeah, I have so Mike. Can send it? I have him. Okay. I need a pen that works. From way back. Let me see the Mexican as as 10 centavos. Hang on. You got it, budget. Right there. Uh oh. We did not storm in. What do you ask? If we found silver tonight. We did not. Swing and a miss. Here, let's do this. <laughs> oh, it's a Panama. It's a Republic of Panama, 1901. And it is 10 centavos out of Panama. <laughs> but then it says 0.9% Two. Yeah. All right, let's do this EOS giveaway. Make sure you comment. I'm gonna put it up one more time. The link. You've got about 30 seconds to get over there and make a comment if you haven't done it yet. Oh, mi familia is from Panama. That is awesome. Hey, Keho, what's going on, bud? Thanks for coming in. I appreciate you. Thank you very much. Much appreciated. If you guys don't have that channel right there, um, he does some gaming over there. He does some late night hangouts. and it's a, it's a fun place to go over there. I just haven't had a whole lot of time to go over there. I do go over there and hang out. Um, he does have a better half. She has a channel also, and they just sit there, and it's a cool place to hang out. Right here is the one that we are going to comment on. Top chat replay. Let me make sure that top chat replays. Yeah, it was all working really good. All right, so I'm going to copy this. Keho, um, you want to get in on this giveaway? You have to go over and comment. You should see it in the link. Can you post it one more time? Um, because it just missed him. Um, budget, I'll click on that one second. Thank you very much for doing that. I'm going to copy that. I'm going to go to the random comment picker. Paste it. YouTube comments. We have 50. Holy moly. All right. Um, so... KO, if you want to go over there and comment on it, I will wait for you. Alexa, set timer for one minute. And maybe you can catch yourself um, some silver here tonight. Thank you for being in here. I appreciate you. Make sure you guys grab that channel up. back hurts my neck and my back I gotta cut my nails okay let me click on this Numista says 
that 10 centavos is 0 0.902 weight of 2.70 grams out of the Republic of Mexico huh. oh it does say Mexicana Republic of Mexicana very very cool Alexa dismiss Thank you very much for that. I appreciate you very much, Budget. Thank you for all your work in here. I appreciate it. All right, let's refresh. Still no. Still no KO in there, I don't think. <coughs> Did you stretch? Uh, no, not so much. We'll get this wrapped up, and then I'll go stretch. I'm glad you didn't say yes, you did, because I had just told her no, he did not. <laughs> I would have been telling on you. Okay, here we go. Yeah, you know what I would like to get is one of those swim spas. Scott R., congratulations. Yeah, that's our next thing is a swim spa. Gonna have to save up a lot. I don't know how much those are, but I bet you they're really expensive. There is five 90 percenters, 10 40 percenters, and two grab bags. Good luck to you, Scott R. Are you in the house? You guys know he's here. He just might have stepped away to catch Oops. a dog or something. Oh, Scott R. Remember, he said he was switching phones because. His phone, His phone was died. dying. Yeah. Are we falling for that trick? No, he was just, just here. All right. He. This I know. Alexa, set timer for one minute. He specifically said his battery one was minute. dying. Starting now. Oh, come here. You're a good boy. <laughs> this puppy's name is Rusty. We call him Rusty Wiggles. He's going to be so sad if he doesn't make it back in time. You know, I got to make it fair. <clears throat> Last call for Scott R. You just set my Alexa wife yelled out, good lord. <laughs> Alexa dismiss. does a lot for the community. Should we give it to him anyway? He's always giving people free stuff. It's your channel. You can do what you want. He literally... He Ty says yes. yes. All right. First, if, well, if Ty says yes, then we have to. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We're going to do that. So it's two grab bags. I mean, he, he literally said my phone's dying. I'm going to, I'll be back soon. Um, five 90 percenters and 10 40s. Drop it in there. Oh, you guys can't see. Hold on. Trust me, they're in there. Nothing up my sleeve. Presto. It is a 40 percenter, but I'm going to send Scott R a barber quarter, which would be a 1900 barber quarter heading to Scott. Oh, and I want to show you guys that they all were in there. One, two, three, four, five, two grabs, and then the 1040s. 
Scott R. got that out of the deal, so congratulations. I'll give him the 42. Here, will you bank a 40% for Scott R., please? Mm -hmm. He doesn't want that. Who won the wheel? I think I missed it. Miss Jeff, no, you haven't missed it. We're doing it right now. Legitimately prefaced his phone situation. Yes, he did. Okay, here we go. Oh, look at Scott R. back. What's going on? Heard my name. Yeah, we pulled you for a drawing. And then Alexi but yelled then at us. We, you timed out a minute, so we had to go on to another. So sorry about that, Scott. <laughs> but I already put congrats up there. <laughs> oh. Everybody agreed that you, your phone was dying. You had told us, and we gave it to you anyway. Yeah, we took <laughs> so a poll. Said, it was so sad. We took a poll, and then everybody <laughs> said, okay, we'll give it to the guy. <laughs> yeah, well, you pulled a 40 out of the bag. It wasn't a 90 or a grab bag. But then I gave you a barber quarter, and then I also gave you the 40, and we banked it for you on your book. So you got to be getting close to another one. Well, I'm going to tell you right now. He has three, so six. Three more, and he'll get a 90. <laughs> I have issues I can't fix with my internet. Yeah, I get it. Um, all right, so here we go with the EOS. <laughs> Let me find the wheel. I don't even know where the wheel went. We're all terrible. <laughs> if I didn't already push the button on that, I would have let it go longer. <laughs> <laughs> all right, here is the wheel. That's not oh, the wheel. that's not the wheel. <laughs> Sorry about that. Wait, let me make sure the last two. Put it back. I need to get a, a color from Clever Coin Hunter. Apparently Never. she's not ready. I'm not ready. I don't know why. We're doing it right now, though. Mischief. Oh, what are we going to give away? Uh, that's for you to see. You're not ready either. Clever yeah, Coin yeah. Hunter, what is your lucky color so I can get you on the uh, donor wheel? Let's give this away. We're going to give away a half ounce koala tonight for the donators. And then on top of that, a barber quarter for a second place. We only got through three boxes tonight, which shouldn't make a difference, but it kind Lucky of does. color is here. purple. There you go. So that koala, oh, what is this? I like purple too. What is this? What is this? I don't know what we got going on here. Let's just give out two half ounce rounds, huh? Yeah. First one will be the koala. And the second place will be this really, really cool Merc Dime replica. Mm. It is a half troy ounce of three nines fine. Matter of fact, first place can pick whether they want the koala. Or they want that Merc Dime replica with a little bit of toning going on on it. She's adding some stuff with ASE Design Reverse. Yes. Want to see it up close, Budget? Stack Dick, you lost the numbers off your name. I still have them on here, though. <laughs> yeah, Mike White, it's not about... It's not about... We don't do this channel to make money on it, for sure. We, But I do have to put gas in my truck. And I have to pay for Band-Aids and stuff when I smash my fingers with boxes. And what else is the cost around here? Oh, spiral notebooks, flips, zips. Oh, that would be really cool to get a squirrel. Bubble wrap. wraps. With his, with his numbers on it. What? 
squirrels. It's, you know how you have the deer and the eagle? Too bad you didn't have squirrel. <laughs> no longer one, two, three. Okay, I'm gonna actually change that in here. Scott Hart took it. He says, I can read the chat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, don't forget shipping. That's true. Yep. And I love going to the coin store. So you guys put gas in my truck so I can go to the coin store. Markers, baggy, scale. It's a big operation. Yeah. And then slab boxes and. All the other stuff that goes along with it. <laughs> and then all the giveaways. But I think that's what we were talking about the first place. Are you done with the wheel? Huh? I am done with the can wheel. Can I have my mouse back you there? You sure can. I was looking at silver keys. Silver keys. You're going to have to take that off. <laughs> Where's my silver? Gear, thank you very much for coming in. I appreciate you, my bud. Hey, where's my silver? How you doing? Hey, what's going on? Where's my... All right, so you guys can see this, correct? Yes, you can see... Uh-oh. Oh, that's me. Sorry. Stop. Oh, wrong keyboard. <laughs> All right, so we have Pammy, Silver Keys, Gordon, Scott, R, Ashes, Mischief, CM, Nerd, Coinster, Silver Keys, Pizza Guy, Clever Coin, Stack Deck. Ooh, thank you all for your donations. I appreciate each and every one of you. Let me see. We are going to do donor winner number one right there. Going to go down to the bottom. We're going to save settings. Go back up to the top. Get to the push the wheel button right there. I'm going to move it over here to the side. And let me bring up. Where's my silver set? Been busy. Yeah, I get it. We've been really busy too. All right, this is first place. This will be for the koala. Right there. Yeah, Mike. That, that too bad we didn't get to hang out when we came through, but we'll hopefully be traveling again soon. Um, matter of fact, you guys can't see these. There they are, right there. One Who's and two. The um, the first place winner will get to pick whether he wants the Merc with the uh, American Silver Eagle on the back or the Koala. If they're in here, if they're not, they're getting the Koala. I want to change. Oh, it's Pammy. I was trying to figure out who, because there's a black, the lettering's black, so I couldn't see who the black. So it's Pammy? Yeah, it's Pammy. Pammy, that is your black slice of pizza right there. Yeah, where's my silver? Thank you very much for being here. Scott, yes, we saw that. Very nice. I, I love that little cabin. Trying to get the boat up and going. Lots of problems this year with it. Yeah, I got a bad battery in my boat right now. Yeah, until the day we're leaving, and then it's fine. That yeah. was weird. <laughs> and then I have a bad button on my trim. Doesn't like to go down. <coughs> And All what, right, and what that is, that brings the motor up and down, in case you don't know that, because that sounded kind of funny. <laughs> really? First place right here. <laughs> oh, shoot. Ashes C4, congratulations. <laughs> <laughs> what? Congrats, Ashes. Clever. <laughs> Five twenty five. <laughs> hey, koala, please, with the trim. <laughs> <laughs> 11 24 p.m. Getting late. It's kind of after hours here. <laughs> Ash is right there in my butt. 
Uh, right there. Thank you very much. Man, I'm going to need some help with these mailings. <laughs> it's, uh, Unfortunately, I'm sorry. I'm going to have to be at work tomorrow. Here's Mike White's EOS foreign silver or 75 like <laughs> or something like that. Okay, don't forget you have to take it. Oh, yeah, when we came through Philly last year. Yeah, Mike, that was kind of a bummer. But it is what it is. Maybe next time. I will be there through there again, for sure. Matter of fact. <laughs> nope, he quit smoking. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, lady, I did. <laughs> yeah, thanks for that, Ty. Really? <laughs> All right, so I got to pull ashes out of this board here. No, the other way. I was looking at the colors. No. Yeah, yeah, you're right, right here. Right. Stop side seat mousing me. Side seat mousing you? Sometimes you need a little side seat. That one there, right? Yeah. Boom, ashes, you're gone. He gone. Got oh. this tape. He's not going in until you save it. Number two, and then I'm going to save it. Boom. 595. Five. I hope you do come back. We have... Um, we usually have it more together at the beginning of the stream. No, we don't. <laughs> we never have it together. And so here they are again. Pammy, Silver Keys, Gordon Scott, Armist, Jeff CM, <coughs> Nerd Coinster, Silver Keys, Pizza Guy, Clever Coin, Stack Bit. Move it over here so you guys can see. Scroll to the top. Scott Arseth, I tried to quit drinking, but Captain and Jack said no. <laughs> Storm is laughing out loud. Whoa, who's that? Mischief. That is the reason you hung out. Wow, look at that. Congratulations. You are getting this coin right here. Matter of fact, let me get rid of this wheel. Boom. For lucky orange color. And I'm going to show you this coin. It is a bullion round, but it's still really cool. Everybody's seen the koala that ashes <laughs> one. This is coming to you. And on the back side... <laughs> <laughs> it's got some toning going on, but it is a half troy ounce of three nines fine. And it's got the ASE with stars. It's really, really neat. I I had a few of these, and this is the last one. Notice it was in my big flip stash over here. Yeah, it is super cool for sure. She might have. Oh, she's here. Yeah, oh yeah, she was here. I was thinking she might have fallen asleep. Whoa. Jack, Jim, Johnny, Jose used to hang out at my house all the time. <laughs> <laughs> I had that crew a bunch of times hanging out. Oh, Jose and all his friends. <laughs> Love the merch, Mischief says. You know... Other than the Morgan, that's my second favorite is the Merc. You should have seen my foodie stream tonight. I was doing it all by myself, wife not here, so I had forgotten a lot of things. <laughs> we'll have to go back and look at it, Stormin. Scott R says, Big Flip, I have a flying eagle scent. I can't read the date on it. If I send you the pictures, would you look at it for me? Yes. You could send me the flying eagle, too. Mm, Clever says, I gotta go with Walker as my absolute fave. Stack Deck, thank you. Stack Deck, appreciate you very, very much. Thank you very much for your donation. Nobody likes the Morgan. I love the Morgan. I think he's just messing with me. I like this coin. This is my new fave. You guys want to see it? My new favorite? I guess I lost it. I love the Morgan. Nobody's going anywhere until I find my gold Did you piece. see the little mean cat 
face. I've never seen that one before. I threw it at Pizza Guy for saying nobody likes the Morgan. Look at that bad scoop. Lady, wasn't it you that <clears throat> told me about the the walker, the older worn out walkers? You'll have Stack to tell, that good night, my bud, thank you. You'll have to tell Clever that if that was you. That's my new fave. That was a half it was a half ounce, right? What's that? Um that half the round. The Merc? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Scott's losing it. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Clever coin says. <laughs> that's my new fave also. <laughs> yeah, that's crazy nice. Look at the date on that thing. 4.5 grams of <laughs> pure loving. Where's my silver? <laughs> that's funny. Oh, no, then it wasn't you. Who was it that told me that? All right, guys, I am going to get out of here. You'll see me Friday at 7 this week. Uh, we are not going to go out and play this weekend, so Friday at 7. Sound good? I hope to see you all here. Do something nice for somebody tomorrow. Pay for it every chance you get. Please keep a day safe distance and be safe. Thank you to my donators. That would be um, Pammy Jones, Mischief, Gordon, Scott, R. Ashes, C4, Mischief, uh, CM Silver, Nerd, Coinster, Pizza Guy, Clever Coin, and Stack Deck. <coughs> Good night and to you all. You Mike to White. Our moderators. We I'm glad you're back, my friend. Thank you very much. Ashes, Budget, <coughs> Siren, Silver Keys, Gear. Thank you all for everything you do for us. God bless to you all. Love you all. I'll see you on the next one. Good night. Take care, my friends. Peace out. Be safe.